Hello. Hello. Hi. I'm sorry for starting to stream like a bit later than I initially planned, but when I woke up this morning, there was no electricity. So I decided to delay it a bit longer just in case because I'm used to the power going out more than once when it goes out. It'll go on and off for a bit, but we haven't had a power failure for the past like hour, so I think we're good. Hi, good morning, good evening, or whatever. How are you guys doing? Hello. Oh, hello, kitty. You're here. Zed, they actually blocked the pride hearts when I opened it in top chat. It only appeared in live chat. So I don't know what I'm getting into here. I just know that it's a strange horticulture. It's a puzzle game. I saw it was on sale and it was listed as um, Lovecraftian. So I think that's interesting. Yeah, it's evening over there, right? Uh, all right, kitty. Yeah, YouTube really. I can't believe it. Well, well, Twitch blocked me from saying lesbian powers, so they're not doing much better. Anyway, I don't know if like anybody's played this one. Ooh, it's clicky. Oh, hello, Emrys. Oh, thank you. I I am garbage. Um. There's not much audio, but uh, is it loud? Yeah, we'll figure it out when we start playing. So it's 8 a.m. 8.30 over here, so... And I know this is a puzzle game, so you're not gonna get much of the brain cell today. Oh, thanks. Okay, that's good. The streets of Undermere are narrow and claustrophobic. In many places, the buildings lean out at the upper floor so that the neighbors can reach across and shake hands, or more likely, exchange unpleasantries. That Junji Ito story. Strange Horticulture is a small shop situated away from the main thoroughfares, but it has the advantage of being one of the few buildings in Undermere that stands alone. Plants, you may have noticed, need light, and light is in short supply at the street level in this town. Is it your turn with the brain? Yeah, it's my turn with the brain cell today. I have to borrow it from the loners, so I'm sorry, Zed. And I'm sorry, Sean, who I saw is going to work. I have to use the brain cell. It's like a one brain cell shared among 33 people. Recently, the shop passed to me after the death of my uncle. There's much to learn, but one thing is already clear. The rare and unusual plants that he stocked have their uses after all. To be fair, even like if only one person is using the brain cell in that group, our, our brain cell does not work very well, Zed. I found it! An excerpt in the elusive wandering Boo... Can't, boo come... Boo, come to the library in Ambleside and I'll tell you all about it. I even found something in the Gilded Dendra that might be of interest. Simone, P.S. Give Hellbore a good scratch behind the ear from me. I hope that's a cat. Oh, it, oh it's a cat! Hello! Street Fighter. Yeah. I don't need to rub the brain cell on anything. I just need it to bounce. If it ricochets off the sides of the inside of my skull, it should spark something. It is very rough in there. Oh, okay. So, let's see. Oh, this is my drawer. I can put this on my desk. Oh, Strange Book of Plants. Cyclopedia can be used as a reference to help identify plants. Note that where I have included sketches, these are not always intended as an aid to identification. Often the description will be more useful to you. Remember to take extra care when dealing with poisonous plants. I accept no responsibility should injury or death occur as a result of the misuse of this environment. That would have been useful when I was a kid because I, as most kids are, I, I have the tendency to chew on things I'm not supposed to. What's this? Oh, it's a map. Okay. Okay, you get back in here. I found it and except in the list of one room. We'll come to the library in Ambleside. Okay, so I have to go to the library in Ambleside. Library in Am Okay, I don't think this is it. I even found something on the Gilded Dinner that might be of interest. 
close to inspection. Oh, okay, that's. Oh, I have a growing fear, de fear deep within me. So this is probably what they're talking about when they say it was Lovecraftian. I pray you struggle in the first puzzle. Is that you don't have to pray? I'm gonna struggle for sure. Okay, so under mirror, and then I have to. Oh, what do you mean? I am back at the shop. You didn't go anywhere. I have neither the time nor the inclination. You can water your plants using the watering can to earn will to explore. Oh, okay. I gotta water plants. I'm gonna drown these things. Oh, that's what it means by I can. Okay, there. Yeah, it is very cute. Okay. I can't tell if these plants are ugly or dying. Okay, now I can... No, that's not where it goes. Okay. We'll have to explore. Ambleside, Ambleside. There we go. I'm just blind. All right. The library here in Ambleside is one of my favorite haunts. Simone, the librarian, is always helpful and friendly and shares some of my passion for unusual plants. Today, she's greeting ear to ear and can't wait to show me what she's found. Collect book entries. Gilded Dendra. Do not drink the sap of this plant. The lips and veins, your lips and veins will turn black as the blood succumbs to Dendra's miasma, a sure and painful way to die. Ooh. The poison is so potent that even touching the leaves of the plant can be painful. Yeah, mainly both. Like, that's why I have a, a succulent, because I don't have to water it that much. But the problem is, it it's like you don't have to take care of the succulent that much, and I somehow managed to mess it up and drop it on the floor. Uh, Wandering view. So-called because the fungus can move slowly in the dark. It has been known to cover distances of several meters in a single night. The gills on the underside of this mushroom form beautiful flowing lines. They are also quite hard and sharp, earning its plant the nickname Fingers Bane. Okay. okay. Oh. I must have walked past this shop a hundred times without ever stopping to look. What a wonderful place to spend your day surrounded by plants. I came here because I have an unusual request. At night, I hear whispered voices, too faint to hear clearly, coming from the floor above me, but nobody lives up there. The rooms are empty. My curiosity has gotten the better of me. I must find out what they are saying. St. John's Poppy? Oh, I need to get St. John's Poppy. Huh. Huh, do I have St. John's Poppy? What plant is this? Okay, wait. Okay, let me open up the encyclopedia. Yeah, gravity is the worst. And I don't think I have... Oh, here's St. John's Poppy. The vibrant petals of this flower can be brewed to create a drought that can greatly improve the imbiber's hearing ability. Okay, is this St. John's Poppy? Or soft and purple... No, bright and red with a yellow center. Okay. I'm gonna try to not poison this lady. Yeah, okay, there we go. Alright, I have to... I have to... Give her plans. So, basically this game is don't kill your customers the game. Use plant. Okay, that's not so bad. Plant identified St. John's Poppy. Collect. According to legend, Clavillium can be used to open any lock no matter how complex or secure. Our change leaves have earned the plant name Love Lock. Murder is fun, yeah. So, but this is a puzzle game where I'm trying to not kill people, so I'm gonna be doing something a little bit different. It's 8.30 a.m. It's too early for murder here. What? Get out of the way. What's this? What's this? The best speed run. You know, just because... Just because this is my first time playing a game, let's try to kill someone. Good morning. Bloody awful weather out there today. Good for the plants, though, eh? I got a letter for you. Oh, I can't kill him. 
Let us say. Gosforth is a hateful town. I was beaten and robbed and left to die in the streets. After many days, I was rescued by a kind stranger just as I had come to fear that wickedness had infected the heart of every soul in that cursed place. I began my recovery in the woods to the south of town with a group of travelers. On the northeast corner of the wood, I sat and stared at a bright flower and tears flowed down my face at the reminder that there's beauty in this world. I shall be returning to Undermere soon. Warmest regards, Amos Duncan. Northeast corner of the woods. I don't know my east from my west. Good thing there's a sign here. Northeast corner of the woods. Like here in Crystal Forest? As soon as I step off the road, to this mem uh, two members of the sisterhood step out to remind me that this is their forest. I'm not welcome here. Okay. Oh, my rising dread went up. Yeah, right hand is east. Yeah. My rising dread is increasing because people told me I could not go to the funny place. Aww. Something's got those witches in the forest stirred up. Yeah, me. They're not letting anyone through. I had to take a long way around down the back barrow. Oh, hello, Tel. Good morning. I never did trust that sisterhood. Anyway, I'm here now and I've brought Fennet from south to trade for some lemon dandy. Hardly worth the trouble when you factor in the extra miles I've covered to get here. Okay, wait. Uh, what's my most poisonous plant? No. Farmer's worry. Great strength for period. No. Yeah, let's let's kill him. Did you just wake up today, Tal? Wait, let's see. Yeah, let's kill him. Oh, okay, so I can't kill him. I have I get rising dread. What happens if I make it worse? I just wanna find out. I got that right? No, that wasn't... Okay. He was supposed to die. New plant acquired. I don't even know what that is. Tries to murder gets the question right. Let me fail. My dreams are becoming more vivid. I saw a woman, her face hidden behind a mask, and next to her, a terrifying black skeletal creature. It stood tall, its roving head scanning the landscape, and though it had no discernible face, I could sense a hint of an expression about its features. It seemed to be laughing, but not the joyous laughter of a child, the sickly horrifying laughter that chilled me like the first breath of winter. Okay, but here's the thing. If you heard laughing and you didn't have a child, that would be the most terrifying thing ever, honestly. These past weeks, I've been getting worse. I need sleep. The forest camphrey. Give her the mushrooms. Okay, so my Rising Dread maxed out. A shiver travels down my spine. My mind is... My mind is broken because I had poor customer service? Okay. Oh, I have to put my mind back together. This is so sad. This fragile Sir Rupert's drop. What kind of This is a this is a puzzle game. Oh no. I was just talking to like uh to my girlfriend about customer service and old people the other day. It was really bad. And now my mind is broken because I'm very bad at because I'm very bad at giving people what they ask for. I have to fix my mind. I'm sorry for destroying the brain cells that I swear I'll give it back. The heck? Oh, here. Uh, I'm not answering that, Zed. I don't. I'm not gonna do that with the brain cell. Don't worry about it. 
Oh, okay, that puts it back together. I think your internet is dying. I don't think it's my internet. I'm not dropping any frames. Let's see. I am so glad this is not timed so I can take a long time to try and fix my brain. Yeah. Cuz like um I don't have a problem right now. I can tell OBS will tell me if something is wrong with my connection. Oh hey lagger. Oops. There it is. I'm fixing my mind. Oh, that was loud. There's a hint button at the right of shot. Okay. So, I can't kill people, but they can give me a bad review. And that will cause me to mind break. Disturbance in connection because I arrived. Yeah, lag lag lagger tends to make people lag out. It it's 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 in the title. Let's go to Um Stone Circle. Nobody knows why these stone circles were built, but standing in this tranquil place, it's not hard to imagine pagan rituals being performed here. Yeah, Gordon Ramsay would probably kill me. Alright, that is Gorgoth. Okay, let's let's put this down here. What's this? Dangerous plant grows sparsely in the hills to the northeast of Backborough. Keep it a secret. Northeast of Backborough. Alright, that sounds good. Oh, it's a kitty. The kitty's awake. I didn't notice. Oops. Hang on, let me get the magnifying glass. Okay. Yes. Oh, it's face with. She looks like the other lady earlier. Oh, no, it is the other lady. Perspective winter. I need sleep. She needs forest camphrey. The forest camphrey. Smelling bulb. Produce beautiful rounded dark blue cluster made up of many smaller flowers. Oh, it's raining over there. Maybe it'll get over here soon. Oh, we, we had a power outage earlier, Del, so I don't. So maybe? Okay, I need... Rounded dark blue cluster made up of many smaller flowers. Blue flowers, light airy scent. Is this it? Hmm. So that's the blue... F or is this it? Rounded... Dark blue cluster, strong smelling bulb. It needs to have a strong smell. Smaller, they smell pleasant. There we go. Flowers made up of many smaller blue flowers. Okay, how about... Is this it? Is this what you want? Oh, no. I'm gonna get fired at this rate. Dark blue. I think dark blue flowers. Hang on. It's powerful soporific, soporific effect. The camphrey produces a beautiful rounded dark blue cluster. So it's not this one. I don't have dark blue flowers. Okay. What about this one? That's not it either. Huh. Okay, where do I get that one though? So I need to... Yeah, it's a uh, strange horticulture. What she wants is forest camphrey. Do I have to find the forest camphrey? Camimum silva. Dark blue. None of these flowers are dark blue. Is this just this one? Blue flower, stiff leaves. No. And it's, it needs to be many smaller flowers. I don't think I have that. It smells of nothing that I can detect. Hang on. What can I do? 
Okay, so she needs sleep. It's character info. Give me a hint. I'm sure I have some of that around. So I do have forest camphrey. But it needs to be dark blue. I used my dark blue. This did not look blue against that light. Hang on. It must have nothing you can detect. No, but it has to have a strong smell. I didn't see this one. Oh, I didn't see that one. There we go. That's the forest camphrey. Plant identified. Collect. Often found. Gr okay, Butterdale. Butterum dixerat. Often found growing in clumps on valley sites, Butterdale has been used for centuries as a cure for all manner of skin rashes. The dark green leaves can be stewed and mulched to form poultice. The flowers smell buttery to some people. Butter. No. Nora Butterfield! Got any wandering boo? It, that always reminds me of, oh, what's his name? The old hermit inventor, the wanderer. Hey, it's you, Tell. Anyway, the boo if you've got it. Let me look for the boo. Wanderer boo. Wandering boo. Here we go. Blue aloe. Rubbery leaves make effective skin repellent and apply it to skin. Hey, Sean! You know any other trash cans? Okay, blue winter after it's blue. Winter boar is hard. No, that's winter boar. Wandering blue is this one. It's the fungus. The fungus that crawls. Okay, gills and other head of the mushroom form beautiful flowing blue lines. Okay, so it's undersized or sharp. This is probably it. Yeah, I know that I can drag a plant there. There we go. Plant identified. Collect. Lady of Summer. Comtessa Estavium. The leaves curl around delightfully which combined with an attractive flower and a hardy nature make this sought after ornamental plant. Aids with conditions of memory deterioration associated. Yeah, I need that. My memory is so bad all the time. I can put labels on this one. I forgot which one you were. Wandering view. Okay. I can put... Yeah, I should put labels on these things. I cannot remember which one is which anymore. I know at least four. But, well, the more trash cans you know, the better, I guess. Let's see. What was I going... I can end... I can play with the cat. Can I throw it? No, I can't. What's this? What's this? Wait, what, where's that rain coming from? Oh, it's the game. Okay, I thought it was raining outside. End day. Hello, co-workers of Sean. It started when she found something. Something that she was not meant to find. A book tucked away in a forgotten corner of the Ambleside Library. Saturday. Oh, it's not raining anymore. That's sad. Row H, Third River. Let's go to the Third River. Row H, Third River. H. One, two, three. A dead deer in the river yellowed bone protruding from a matted high end rotten flesh. Death for one provides life for many. Collect the plan. A new plant acquired. I have no idea what that is. Okay, you get in here. Isidore Burbridge. Bur 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 Burbage. Bring me a sample of Apis Demesis and be quick about it. That damn cat is setting off my allergies. You get out of my store. No, you get out of my store. I have no idea what Apis Demesis is. Uh, let me see. Dangerous plant. No, that's not it. Apis Demesis? Uh, let me look it up, actually. Do I have Apis Demesis in here? No, I don't. I don't think I own this plant. Uh -huh. So I have to look for it. Archive? Wandering... No, that's Wandering View. Oh, wait. Maybe there's... It's a... 
maybe it's a scientific name. Apis Demesis. There we go. It's the candy root. Let's call it the candy root. Plant with medicinal properties can aid digestive troubles when prepared correctly. Care must be taken as the rough leaves can be an irritant. Only the petals are safe for consumption. So it looks like that. Oh, this is probably it. Single pink flower. No, that's not it. A plant with medicinal properties. So it needs to have rough leaves. Rough leaves. Is this it? The leaves are coarse. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it's Gandhi root. Okay. Meek dew. The beautiful flowers made up many smaller florets. Make this a thought after decorative plant, although it's difficult to care for it. Maybe pleasant looking plant, but touching the leaves against bare skin will result in painful sores. Uh, let's see. I should probably label this one. What was, what was your name again? The Gandhi root. Right. Candy root. Candy root. I wonder if my cat eats any of the plants here. Hello. Oh, it's you again. Oh, it's the mailman. Lake Undermere is looking fine in the sunshine today. Here's your mail. Get out of here. There's this old there's an old slate mine at Hard Knot as some interesting looking fungi growing in it. I've never seen anything like them before. They seem to have found a niche in the damp, dark tunnels left by the tramways. I thought you might be interested. Old slate mine, Hard Knot. All right, let's go to Hard Knot. 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 You guys ever like chew on plants hoping oh there we go. Ever chew on plants hoping it to like help you out? The iron gate that's rust an iron gate rusted by the years of abandonment sits across from the tramp tunnel. Rusted it may be, but it won't budge. Lock. Cause like when I was still um when I was still young when I was I was what was he when I was still young when I was younger, there um I used to chew on these like small four petal flowers I can't remember what they're called the red ones and then what people like to do is they like to pull the middle parts out so that like a small bead of dew would come out I don't remember what they were called but I used to chew on those like they weren't particularly helpful for anything I was sick with but then I used to trick myself into thinking they tasted sweet. I'm headed to the Grisdale Forest. Investigating a possible murder there. Okay. Can't seem looking forward to it. The sisterhood are a secretive lot and they're not keen to talk to me. Their leader, the Arda, or whatever they call her, she's dead. My instinct is they're hiding something. I was hoping you might have some fox button that would help me win them over. Okay, fox button. An offering of fox button is considered by some to represent the contract of friendship. Shiny leaves grow. Shiny leaves, shiny leaves. Is this it? No, wait, that's not shiny leaves. And I don't think it said that was shiny. Blue flower, stiff leaves, no. Blue flower, stiff leaves. Shiny leaves? Smooth, waxy leaves, no. Shiny leaves? It smells like nothing I can detect. Um, Gandhi root. Paleo leaves are quite soft, no. 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 I need to look for something for that for that. It has to say that the leaves are shiny. I have to send the scratches the back of my throat. It's nice to know though that my sanity comes back just after a good night's rest. Buttery. No. Sweet scent dipped in honey. Airy. No. Small leaves, delicate flowers. Thick, shiny leaves grow in opposing. Okay. Thick, shiny leaves. Small red berries. Um. Sweet scent. So either. Okay, wait. So either the leaves are not what I'm looking for because they have to be thick and shiny, or they're using a different word to describe them. Cream colored flowers, they smell wonderful. Sweet scent. Smooth waxy leaves. 
The vein leaves have a waxy finish. The one that comes closest to it is this one. The one that has small leaves. Oh, no, wait. No, no not that one. Blue flowers, stiff leaves. Along the stems. Yeah, this is probably it. So either this or this. Small leaves, delicate flowers. So let's see. No, those are thorns. That is not it. Let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna give this guy a random plant. Oh wait, no, what's this? Nothing. Wait, what? Smells of nothing that I can attack. Okay. Yeah, it's it's maybe this one. No, 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 not this one. This one. The one with the. It needs fox button. Oops. So, nope, that wasn't it. So it's this one. No, it's not it either. Wait. It needs to have. Oh, um. No, that's Gandhi root. Uh, fox button. Fox button. Are you... What? No, this one doesn't smell like anything. Speaking of putting what's not overpowering. Smooth waxy leaves. Thick shiny leaves. Oh. Okay, so I only have three tries before I lose my mind. What? Okay, so it's different now. A shiver travels down my spine. My mind is broken. Again. That was easy. Oh. Oh, it's one of these. I have to find keys to fix my brain. They all look like the letter E. E. I feel revived. My mind is whole again. How many times am I gonna? Is my brain gonna fall apart in this stream? Tram. We thought. Uh, hard knot. Yeah. Okay. It's an old trick. Mine and hard knot. We were looking at hard knot earlier. Where did you go? Hard knot. There we go. Okay. Clavillium leaf. So, oops, get out of here. Old mine. Okay. Reuben Ward. Yeah, yeah, you're the one who's looking for Fox Button. Hmm. It's not you. Oh, I need to close your inspection this. How about you? They smell pleasant. That's not you. That's not... What? The leaves are quite soft. No, they're thick and shiny. They should be thick and shiny. Box button. Okay, give me a hint. Yeah, okay. That's not much of a hint. You just basically tell me to do what I was already doing. Okay, um... Smell is off-putting. Scent that scratches the back of my throat. Onion, but not unpleasant. Pale flowers, soft leaves. Veined leaves. Thick and shiny is the word that I'm looking for. It's not that, right? I've tried that one. Red berries. Let's see. Thick shiny leaves grow in a post. I start gonna lose my mind if I thick shiny leaves one more time. Mm hmm. That's sweet, just in honey. Okay, wait, do you have another hint for me? It's one of these plants. What? Okay, hang on. It's not. I know it's like. It's not this one. It's not this one either. Where is that one? It's probably not this one, right? 
rough glass paper. And those are not growing along the side. Wait, I'll keep the hint. It might be this one then, but like, is that really it? Hang on. Show over here. Oh, that's Gandhi root. It's not fox fox button. I'll repeat that one. Like, wait, by process of elimination, it's this one. But it doesn't say anything about its leaves. Oh, you're kidding me. Okay, so that's Fox Button. Hang on. Brimlock, Folium Caldarius. Suffering from hypothermia can be brought can be rescued by a drought made by leaves from Brimlock plant. It has a warming effect, protects us against extreme cold. When conditions are just right in the cold of winter, Brimlock produces small yellow flowers. The leaves are waxy and tough. No, you. That was bullshit. Okay, let's uh. Fox Button. You cannot tell me that the hint is going to be okay. Never mind. I guess that's why it's a puzzle game sometimes. Okay, Victoria Green. I was able to make out the whispered voices last night with the help of Saint John's Poppy. Okay, there's a medium using the room illegally, I might add, holding midnight seances for gullible grievers. Is there a plant you know of that I could use to scare them? Use give them a scare and drive them away. I need my sleep. I need the Harlequin Blue. Harlequin blue, harlequin blue, harlequin blue. When the bushy blue flower heads die, they release seeds with a downy pappus, which assists in wind dispersal. Once dried and hardened, the stems can be burned in incense. As they burn, they let out high pitched. Sh That's cool. Bushy blue flowers. Bushy blue flowers. Are these bushy blue? These are bushy and blue. Yeah, it's a light airy scent. This is it. Harlequin Blue, collect. Shimmerlung. The dried sum of the Shimmerlung burns very brightly and noisily, letting off a near blinding white purple light. Why are these flowers so cool? I wish I had a flower that screamed. Harlequin Blue. Bethany Coleman. You may have heard the rumors about that our Arda is dead. May Arduina bring her spirit peace. The nature of her death is unusual. The sisterhood does not often look to outside help, but this is beyond our knowledge. If you show my sisters this letter, they will allow you entry to the forest. To be assured of your, of your discretion, we require that you use Mary's breath to bind yourself to secrecy. Mary's breath. Mary's breath. The wide ah oh, yeah okay I saw that one already wide waxy leaves this is you right yep this is you okay Mary's breath and I got the letter labels oh hang on go away Mary's breath let's go over here open the letter. We have failed in our duty as protectors of the forest. Our secrets have been stolen and the Arda has been murdered. You will find us deep in Grisdale Forest, a mile from the lakeshore across from Torver. Please help us. Yours in hope, the sisterhood of Arduina. Let's see. You'll find us deep in Grisdale Forest, a mile from the lakeshore across from Torver. Grisdale Forest, a mile from Torver. Grisdale Forest. Where's Torver? A mile from Torver. So it's over here. This is Torver. And that's a mile away. Yeah, it's about here. A sister tries to stop me from entering, but I show her the letter and she lets me through. I am ushered into the walled courtyard and then through the large oak door along a corridor and, and down a set of stone stairs into a cool basement. Lying on a table draped in silk is the Arda. There is not a mark on her, but her open eyes are black. Her mouth, her veins, her hair, all black as a raven's wing. Do you know what could do this? Ask my escort. I set to work. Okay. Okay, let's see. Interesting. Okay. 
Do I have the Ren? Ren. The long leaves of the Ren are known to turn black in the presence of certain poisons and can be used to detect them. Though it has no flower, it is said to smell. It's unpleasant to those who. Okay. So I need a flower with. I need. I need a flower without flowers. And it smells unpleasant. Scratches the back of my throat. So let's see. Fl oh, wait. This is it? Smooth waxy leaves. No, that's not it. I think it's this one. Yeah, I think it's this one. Those who have known death. I need to like wait for the timer to come back. Okay, well that's happening. I'm gonna water my plant so I get more will to explore. I mean, I guess watering plants and taking care of them makes people happier. So I guess I can understand where the will to explore comes from. Hang on, I have a customer. Isidore Burbage. I'm this close to reporting you, halfwit. The blast plant you gave me has made my skin itch furiously. I'll have you torn. I'll have your little shop shut down and torn to the ground if you don't make this right. Okay, wait. So what? He, so what's his problem? His problem is uh, what I last gave him did not help with his allergies. Meet you. No, that will make it worse. I need to get Butterdale. Butterdale, Butterdale. Where's my Butterdale? Often found growing in clumps of valley sides, Butterdale has been caused for simply to cure all manner of skin rashes. The dark green leaves can be stewed and mulched. The flowers smell buttery to some people. Okay, I remember you. One of you smells buttery. One of you smells like butter. No, not you. You don't smell like butter. No. Where are you, buttery plant? Colored flowers, no, that's not you. These are quite soft. Butter. Butter. Where are you? I know I have the butter plant. The butter? No. It's a strawberry dipped in honey. Butter. Yeah, there we go. Butter. Butterdale. Collect. Okay, the story end. The dark red fruits should not be ingested under any circumstances. They are highly poisonous, resulting in insanity and then death. Delicious. The scar section of the stem shows the distinctive triple asylum and phloem of the story end. Oh, I remember asylum and phloem. I was taught that when I was like high school science class, biology. Yeah, I need to give them the wren. Uh, you go over here. Which one was the wren again? Ren. Long leaves of the Ren are turning black. No flower. Okay, so I need to put the Ren there. Use plant. There we go. I extract a sample of the artist's blood and introduce it to the Ren, and my suspicions are confirmed immediately. The leaves of the Ren turn black, which can only mean one thing gilded dendro poisoning. Upon presenting my findings, I am rushed away quickly. The sisters do not want me hanging around, it seems. They do, however, send me on my way with a couple of plants which I am grateful for. What plants did I get? Gray Sandfire. Sandfire is a tough outer bark which has many useful properties. Some chew it as a form of dental hygiene, taking care not to swallow as it can cause unpleasant stomach distress. The flame-like tendrils give off smoky scent, adding to the impression of a roaring fire. Collect the plants. Yeah, that one looks sick. End the day. North of Hawkshead, east of Lowick, west of Rusland, south of Crinkle Crags. The book books fascinated and terrified her in equal measure. And after studying it for some time, she reached a decision. She would never use the power she had discovered. She would hide the book where it could never be found. Day three. Sunday, the scariest day. North of Hawkshead, east of Lowick. North of Hawkshead, east of Lowick. West of Rusland, south of Crystal Crack. North of Hawkshead, east of Lowick. 
north of Hawkshead. North of Hawkshead. Where are you? Oh no, I should not be allowed to read maps. North of Hawkshead, east of Lowick. Oh, south of, there we go, south of Crinkle Crags. So it's here, north, east of Lowick. Where are you, Hawkshead? North of Hawkshead, east of Lowick. What? Oh, okay, north of Hawkshead, east of Lowick. What was the other one? North of Hawkshead, east of Lowick. West of Rusland. East of Lowick. North of Hawkshead, east of Lowick. South of Crinkle Crags. West of Lorus? Lorus. Lorus. So it's this way. South of Crinkle Crags. West of Lorus. Where where where's that last one? Lorus, Lorus. Lois. Oh wait, I I I I, I, I probably misread that. Rusland. What the heck is Lois? No, oh, Lowick. Okay, west of Rusland. West of Rusland. Where is my Rusland? Rusland. I'm sorry if you can hear the chickens. By the way, I have no control. Lois, where are you? Ah, uh, Rusland. Sorry. I don't know why I keep looking for Lois. Lo Rusland, Rusland, Rusland. Rusland. So it's somewhere in this area. Rusland. What? How can it be west of Rusland? I can't see Rusland. I must be blind. Rusland is... Hang on. Oh, there. Sorry, Rusland. Wait, how are you west of Rusland but east of Hawk's Head? West of Rusland. Oh, north of Hawk's Head, east of Lowick. Okay. North of Hawk's Head, east of Lowick. West of Rusland. South of Crinkle Crags. This is it. My eyes are drawn to the silhouette of a grizzled old man standing on the edge of a field. His mind is broken, seemingly beyond repair. Vacant eyes fixate on nothing. A whisper of an expression as my gaze sweeps his face, but only a whisper. He raises his arm. Points. I follow his outstretched finger, and I'm surprised to find a cluster of wildflowers growing there, hidden from view. Got new plants. They're very ugly. Ding. I'm looking for a plant, um, Lady of What's It, something or other. Ugh, I'm no green eyed drear, that's for sure. My mind isn't at all what it used to be. The one that's supposed to help me with mental decline. So, the Lady of Summer. Okay, okay. The Leaves Girl Wonder. Yeah, okay, this one. I remember this one. Leaves curl around delightfully. Curl around the flower delightfully. Hard. Okay. Isn't this it? Oh. Hard nature. This is probably it. What? Okay, no, it's not it. Do I have any other flowers that look like that? No, it's candy root. Okay. Curl around delightfully, which combined with an attractive flower. And this one? What? Okay, wait. How about the mind break for the third time today? 
Lady of Summer. Lady of Summer. Lady of Summer. I don't want to keep using hints. Do I have... Wait, do I have it? Do I even have it? Hang on. Oh, I don't have it. So that's what's happening. There's this old slate mine at Hard Knot. Something interesting looking... Some, no, not that one. Gothforth. Northeast corner of the wood. South of the town with a group of travelers in the northeast corner of the wood. So south of a town but northeast of the wood. And this is it, right? Okay. Okay, that wasn't it. I have to I have to walk around for a bit, so we'll just be watering flowers for the time being. Oh. I wonder what the customers think when they see like the guys like, oh I don't have the flower, I have to go all the way out into the forest. Would you be willing to wait until tomorrow? They must be super patient. Or they must be very desperate. Puzzle games at like 9.30 a.m. are the best. Okay. So, wait. Okay. Gothfort is a hateful town. I was beaten and robbed and many days I was rescued by kind of thing. Just decided to come to fear the wickedness. So, Gothfort. I have to look for Gothfort. Oops. My mistake. I have to look for Gothfort. And then I have to go towards... That's the Crinkle Crags, Gosforth, Gosforth, Foxfield, Ravenglass, Winter Whitefell, Boodle, Blackcomb, Gosforth. Oh, here, okay. Northeast of the wood. Oh, there we go. Yeah, this is it. I found it. I'm so smart. He's playing. Lady of Summer. The Fennet. Chewing the tough route of this plant is said to increase to ease gastric, in, not increase, ga gastric distress and reduce anxiety. It has it has soft leaves. Let me just uh Lady of Summer here. Lady ah, Lady of Summer. My desk is a mess and I also need to fix my setup. Like I've told like the other people before this, but I have a curtain set up so that it muffles the sound somewhat, the one that comes out so I can stream without bothering people. But like what's happened is now this thing is draped over my head and I have a problem seeing anything. I, I can't move properly and I worry that this thing is going to hit my mic when I go to grab my water. Ding. It's you again. Hang on, water. Water break. I know a lot of people don't trust that sisterhood, but it seemed to me that the Arda always looked out for the less fortunate. Collect. Oh, he's got will to explore. The cold is too much to bear beyond the gap. I was forced to turn back. I would advise against it, but if you are determined to explore the Great Gable, I'd be sure to take precautions. Knowing you, I'm sure you'll have to plant up your sleeve that can keep you warm should the weather turn against you. Warmest regards, Amos Duncan. Witches are the most trustworthy. Yeah, I would believe that. Do I have a plant that keeps me warm? Let's start from the bishop's parasol. Yeah, but I don't trust. I don't know how much I trust you. Uh, let's see. Keep me warm. Keep me warm. Keep me warm. Like the thing is, if if I gave you enough spells, the towns would be on fire. I'm just saying. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, you're the wren. 
hearing ability, wandering blue. Highly poisonous. No, it's hard to plant off and find. I don't have anything that's actually warm. So I'll probably have to search for one. There's an old slate mine at Hard Knot that has some interesting looking funji growing in it. I've never seen anything before. You seem to have a niche in the damp, dark tunnels left by the tramways. Thought you'd be interested. Yeah, okay, let's. We've been to Hard Knot before, but I don't think we found anything last time we went. Hard Knot. Hard Knot. Hmm. Hard Knot. This is why you shouldn't have me navigate hard knot. Oh look, it's Tally. Hello. There, hard knot. Uh, uh waterways did they say? What did they say? What did the letter say? No. A gap. Dangerous plant grows sparsely in the and I to back borrow. No. Old slate mine at Hard Knot that has some interesting looking fungi. So yeah, it's it's just at Hard Knot itself, I guess. Get over here. Where are you? Hard Knot. Or is it the Ilgil head? No. Oh, I need Clavillium. That's what's been saying. Uh, I run a flower store with weird flowers. Do I have Love Lock? I need Clavillium, aka Love Lock. The heart shaped leaves. These are heart shaped. There we go. Oh, I got free plants because I used the flower to unlock the mines. Aguria collect these These all look terrible. It's amazing. Okay. Ding. This plant is cursed. All of my plants are cursed. It has brought me nothing but sorrow. Maybe you suck. Please take it with you. I want nothing more to do with it. Why give it to me? Wow, it's so ugly. Okay, you. What do you want? Simon Green. Hellbore. I al always a pleasure, my feline friend. Oh, okay, that's my cat. I hope he hasn't been nibbling the plants again. I think he'd be dead if he was. I have a favor to ask. You owe me for the hours I spent digging out the information on those plants, okay? I've been burning the midnight oil again and can use some common trouts, and I know where to find it. Okay. According to Grayson's Herbology, it grows in abundance on Red Pike. I'll come by the day after tomorrow to collect it. I have business in Sedberg in the meantime. Alright, so I have to go get at the Red Pike. Red Pike. Where are you? Red Pike. I enjoy a pleasant stroll up the fell. The go and going is easy. The weather agreeable and the view is majestic. I do not have to look hard to find what I am after. Okay, that was easy enough at least. Oh, I'm out of will to explore. Get out of my way. I have to water some flowers to get more will to explore. I remember one time when I borrowed the watering can and then I was just playing around with it, so I took a bath using the watering can. And then my mom told me off because apparently they put pesticides in the watering can, so I was in a lot of danger. Verona Green. When you work with the occult, I find it pays to uphold a certain image. If you're going to be accused of performing witchcraft anyway, it doesn't hurt to put a bit of show every now and then. Let the punters know that I'm capable of that sort of thing. Long story short, I may have threatened to turn a small boy into a toad. The little bugger called my bluff. Very ungirl boss of you. Go on. Oh, don't look at me like that. You know what little boys are like. I can assure you he deserves to be turned into a toad. Anyway, I think a little display is needed to discourage his sort of behavior in the future. 
You got any shimmer lung? Oh yeah, I, I remember I have some shimmer lung. Shimmer lung, shimmer lung. It's a miracle you survived your. St Look, I I am at this point. I am quite sure that I am invincible. Okay, like nothing nothing can destroy me except myself. Large rigged leaves. The flowers. I don't think I have this one. Hang on. Dangerous plant grows sparsely in the hills northeast of Backbarrow. I'm gonna go to Backbarrow. Northeast of Backbarrow. Like, I've eaten paint, I've eaten metal, I've covered myself in pesticides, I constantly get food poisoning. That does not look like Shimmer Lung. Oh, wait. Oh, that's Mary's breath. So, Shimmer Lung, according to the book. Do I have Shimmer Lung? Yeah, I have apparently. The dried sun of the Shimmer Lung burns very brightly, almost and noisily, letting off a near blinding white purple light. Flowers grow wrapped in large, ridged leaves. Isn't this it? I am one step away from getting like mind broken. Hang on. And I don't want to lose all the progress that I made today because I actually made a fair bit of progress. Tried sound of the shimmer lung burns. Next thing. It's one of these. I can't believe I have it. I didn't notice this one. I have this one. Pleasant's leaves have stiff ribs. Yeah, I think this is it. That's Shimmer Lung. Candlewood. Produces a red flower that provides a shielding effect, protecting against all manner of afflictions of the mind. Long thin stems grow among tall leaves. Ruth Douglas. There's a beautiful plant that I've been looking for all over, but nobody seems to have any. Mmm, something. Monk brew? I'm not sure. I do know though that you shouldn't touch the leaves though. Okay. It's very chill, yeah. It's a perfect stream. Meek Jew is what you mean. Yeah, this is it. The beautiful flower made up of many smaller florets made sought after decorative. Touching the leaves against bare skin. So it's many. S the beautiful flower is made out of many smaller flowers. Okay, so it's a small flower. It's a big flower made out of many small flowers. And I shouldn't touch the leaves. No, not you. Let's see. Where are my... No, that's the harlequin blue. Where are my, clump, my clusters of flowers? This one. They smell pleasant. Hmm. No, that's fox button. Candy root. No. No. Okay. Do do I own it? Is the question. Yeah, they want me to. I get I get that one. Mollify them. So it has to be a, s a bunch of small florets, and then like I have to get hurt. Now that's rhubarb, red red flowers, small leaves, delicate flowers. That's a harlequin blue. Purple flowers have a light buttery scent. That one's one of the obvious ones. That's buttersdale. These are mushrooms. No flowers, sparse leaves. Smooth waxy leaves. Cream colored flowers. Red flowers. Then again, would I know if it is? Because it feels like it would injure me if I tried to touch it. 
This one is like the... Yeah, the small person. What's this? Red fruit, long flat leaves. No. Wait, I should label the shimmer long. Hang on. Shimmer long. Uh, let's see. Small florets. It looks like this, but also not. Like, what's this one? Dark blue flower smells like rhubarb. It looks like this. The thing is, I have to go off image sometimes because it also looks like this, though. No, but it needs to have, it's a four, it's got four, four, four petals that expand outward like that. I feel like donkey looking for the blue flower with red thorns. Oh, this is it. Yeah, small leaves delicate like flowers you plant. There we go. Meet you. Oh, I survived the day. This is just proven to me that if I ever work in like customer service, everyone will be getting the wrong orders all the time. Close the book and the day. Draw from the deck. In time passed the year and then another. The book remained hidden but out of sight. This did not mean out of mind. The book was that her th was what her thoughts settled on when she dreamed. Ah, oh, it's a Monday. It's the best day. So where is that? Is that Boodle? It's Boodle, right? It's Boodle. Although technically a town, Boodle's small population. Okay, it's not Boodle. No. I feel like I'm supposed to match the edge of this thing. There we go. Okay, so it's a black home. I need more will to explore. Where's my watering can? There we go. Yeah, this is a chill game. Like, I expected to use the brain cell even harder. And again, I'm very sorry for borrowing it, but I need to use it right now. But, you know, I'm surviving. I'm chilling. I'm thriving. I'm lucky these aren't actual plants because I have not watered them in forever. Let's go black comb. Yeah. Oh, that was not it. Oh, and that increased my rising dread. It's just a little bit above. It's just beside Blackcomb. Just, just beside it. All right. We'll take explore. He's so cute. If only my shop did not look so ugly. I need to clean my shop. Ruben Ward. The fox button has no help. I'm afraid the sisterhood still refused to openly speak with me. Not that I have the time to pursue it properly. I'm rushed off my feet this week. There's been a body found in Swinside Stone Circle and appears it's a, apparently it's a grisly one. Don't suppose you've got anything to help keep my lunch down. My stomach's never coped too well with the grisly ones. Oh wait, Fennet, 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 Fennet. Hang on, wait. Let me go to Black Home first because I, you know, I, I, I've been doing that one. Yeah, a reset. New plants acquired. Let's close this one. 
price fluctuating rumors and a piece of paper with all. Oh, that sounds interesting. Wait, he needs me to give him Fennet. That was funny. If I remember right, this one was marked as Lovecrafty and Horror a while back. I don't remember if that's completely correct. Chewing on the root of this. Long, soft leaves. No spa no flowers, sparse leaves. No, long and soft leaves. No, it's not you either. There are so many flowers. This is gonna get messy real fast, really soon. And I need to keep track. Long, soft leaves. Soft, pale blue flowers. No. Rather than doesn't smell. Long soft leaves. No. Long soft leaves? No. Shimmer long. Over there. Stiff leaves. I kept touching that one earlier, the long soft leaves. Yeah, okay, this one's it. That's Fennet. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm a witch. Long, soft leaves, fennet. Yeah. Morning. Verona Green handed me this for you. She seemed in a good mood. I meant to tell you this yesterday, but it slipped my mind. I discovered a plant on the recent trip to Grisdale, North Grisdale Forest, just northeast of Rusland. It looks nothing like I've seen before. It would have brought it back with me if the sister had a moment, but it seemed overly protective lately. Verona Green. Grisdale Forest, northeast of Rusland. Grisdale Forest, northeast of Rusland. Northeast. There we go. Nobody may wander freely through the forest by the order of Arda, says the leader of you. But I turned to walk back, but then again, I have a few tricks up my sleeve. Oh, I don't... Ah, oh, I should have used the Mellow Glow. Okay, okay, okay. Which one of you is the Mellow Glow, though? Wait, do I have a Mellow Glow? Mellow Glow. Mellow Glow has sharp thorns that protect it from predators. I only have one plant that has that. So yeah, probably it's probably that one. What am I gonna do? Hit them with the plan? Okay. After water. Ah, wait, I'll fill it this order first. I'm afraid the camphor you gave me is helping me sleep and I'm very grateful for it, but the visions are as strong as ever. The woman in the jade mask appears in my dreams every night. She screams at me, but I do not know why, and behind her that presence is always there dark and dreadful. I don't know what to do. The dreams feel like a warning that I don't understand, a mosaic of colors that refuses to come into focus. Some part of me wants to stare down the abyss, but I'm afraid. Aguria or Candlewood? What does Aguria do? It strengthens the visions. Yeah, let's let's drive her crazy. Light blue tufts. Yeah. Let's go. Let's drive her nuts. Aguria. Worryless. Worryless. Oh, so what I have to do is I have to. Uh oh, my watch is ringing. Shut up. Anyway, um, here we go. The mellow glow. Hiya! Wait, what? I don't have a mellow glow? Do I own the mellow glow? Yeah, I own the mellow glow, but like... Is it this one? That's the mellow glow! Okay, with the help of the mellow glow, I walk right past the sisters without them paying me any head. Chuckling to myself, I collect the plant to Verona, talk to and take my leave. Okay. How about that? Let's go mellow glow. Where'd you go? There you go. Mellow glow. Mellow 
cool. Yeah, I like that. You can make your own mess on the table too. Correct. New plant acquired. You get back in here. I don't know what you do. Yet. Oh. Oh, okay, I see. I don't fully get it, but I see. Come on. Yeah, okay. There's that. I'll probably have to play a bit more before I get more stuff. You get back in here. Mm-hmm. Oh wait, I need to put you in the archive. We don't come to Undermere often, but I heard about your shop and I said to Francis, we, mu we simply must pay a visit. It's a wonderful breath of li a life in an otherwise dreary town. I'm the green-fingered one, and it's not really his cup of tea, but I persuade him the trip would be... would do him good. And besides, he'll be wanting to take a boat out on the lakeside. Shame about this awful weather, though. You must come to Sizerg. We have a small library with... Oh, yay! Horticulturalist as yourself. Lord and Lady Elspeth, you're cordially invited to Sizerg Castle. Okay, so I was wondering why the sound of rain was so, you know, realistic. It turns out it's raining here right now. You were cordially invited to Sizer Castle, Lord and Lady Elspeth. Yeah, let's go to Sizer Castle. That's the wrong castle. Sedberg. At Sedberg. Kendall. Undermere. On the side. Sedberg. 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 Sizeberg. Is the name of the castle Sizeberg or am I just reading it again? Sizerg. There we go. Sizerg Castle. What? Where are you? Sizerg, Sizerg. There we go. Sizerg Castle. I missed. I missed. I missed. Oh, come on. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna water my plants while I wait. It was a miss input. I feel like now my mic is picking up on everything. You can hear everything. So I might have to change my mic setup again. Or at the very least OBS is reacting to every single noise that I make. So I don't know if you I don't know if you guys can hear some of the swallowing noises that I'm making or whatever. But OBS says that you can. I missed Sizer Castle, alright. Sizer, Sizer, where are you? Sizer. I am greeted enthusiastically by Lady Elsbeth herself. She is very talkative and has many questions on horticulture that I do my best to answer and she takes me on a tour of the gardens. Oh, you must take a sample of this back with you, she exclaims, pointing out a plant that I do not recognize, but before I can stop and take a look, she has already whisked me on to the next. And, th and this one too, she says. I'm quite exhausted by the time we make it to the library, and I don't have the time to make a story or a as I would like. Nevertheless, I am able to find an interesting entry that I note down. Don't forget these, Lady Elspeth cries as I make to leave. She thrusts the plants from the gardens to my hands, and I thank her warmly. At least they're nice to me. The fever kiss. Okay. Mushroom. Red spores moves in the dark. That's all I've got. Any ideas? Yeah, I have that actually. Mushroom, red spores, moves in the dark. What's your name again? Something. Night something? Lady Night. Story in Wandering View. Slowly in the dark, gills on the side, hard. 
hard on your side. Is it the wandering view? Mushroom red spores moves in the dark. What's my wandering view? I know I labeled that one. Yeah, mushroom red spores moves in the dark. This is it? Yeah, I already identified the wandering view. Okay, good to know that you can't hear everything that I'm making. But I am gonna fix myself a bit. Uh, the curtain is a bit annoying. Ding. They're saying Black Comb is haunted now. Bradley Miller told me he saw the ghost of a huge deer, antlers and all, but then Bradley Miller also says he can talk to squirrels. Either way, there's something evil in them hills, and I'm not taking any chances. Awful what happened to that poor young man up at Swinside. I've come for some stinking mount cap. Okay, so she wants some sunset mount cap. Sunset mount cap. Sunset mount cap. Uh oh, I have no idea what that is. Um. Give me a second. Fingers being hmm. Yeah. This is it. My problem is the cold is too much to bear beyond the gap. I am forced to turn back. I would advise against it. Tell me to explore the great, great gable. Yeah, I have to go to the great gable. Brimlock. So I need Brimlock. Yep, alright. Brimlock. Those suffering from hyperthermia can be rescued by a drop made by using these of Brimlock plant. It has a warming effect that protects against extreme cold. When conditions are just right in the cold out of winter, Brimlock produces a small yellow flower. The leaves are waxy and tough. So it has no flowers and it has waxy and tough leaves. I think I know which one that is. Waxy and tough. He's back. There we go. That's Brimlock. Okay, collect. Sunset Mount Trap. One Mount Cap. There we go. The Sunset Mount Cap is a type of fungus which domed caps, sometimes called stinking mount cap, as a result of the unpleasant odor. It's thought that there are unwanted souls and spirits from entering the home. So yeah, we're looking for like a stinky one. Viscous white liquid. Mushroom plant with red warts. It smells rotten. Alright. I think that's it. Uh, mount cap, mount cap, stinking mount cap, sunset mount cap. No, but it's domed. This isn't domed. Okay, so it has to be domed. A domed mushroom that smells bad. Dome the mushroom that smells bad. Oh, wait. Yeah, there we go. Stinking mount cap. The henchuck. Two burst bulbous an unusual structure growing in bursts that give it a striped appearance when cut open. The outer layer hardens and turns blue. Green and is ready to harvest. Uh, let me put the mount cap. Oh, thank you for the labels. <laughs> she lives alone in the castle to the northwest of the abbey. She buried her husband three miles to the east where Everheart grows. At 15, her mother's strong, dependable loving was struck down by typhoid. The girl drew inward as her father turned to drink. She lives alone in the castle to the northwest of the abbey. She buried her husband three miles to the east where the Everhart grows. Northwest of the abbey. Three miles to the east. The abbey. 
northwest of the Abbey. Northwest of the Abbey. One, two, three. Three miles east. Northwest of the oh three oh northwest okay the castle What have you done to me? I see the woman in jade mask everywhere and that creature that stands over her shoulder I almost feel like I can sense its desires. It's afraid of the sisterhood that much is clear it will lay waste to them. So much death, but it can be avoided with Arduina's protection. I do not know if I'm awake or asleep even now. I feel the darkness staring at my mind. You know, okay, I'll give you some worry less. That's not very helpful, okay. Uh, hint. Help release, help relieve anxiety. It's the pleasant smelling one then, right? Yeah, okay, let's try this one. That's the worry list. Hmm, it's the hot part. Let me put the label in this one. Hang on. Worry list. Worry list. I'm gonna put you back here. She lives alone in the castle to the northwest of the abbey. She braided up in three miles to the east where the Everheart grows. Where does the Everheart go? Oops, wrong. This is... One mile, two mile, three miles to the east. A dead tree, its bark cracked and blackened by fire, stands alone on the hillside. Off to one side, a patch of flowers grows in a low mound. Yeah, so she's hallucinating and I made it worse. If you didn't uh, see the last part that I did, she was like, give me something to either make to, to make the visions go away and I gave her something that made the visions go wilder. I met a strange man on the road in Sedberg not two days ago. Stranger still, a he asked... Yeah, after you. He said he had something for you. Don't ask me what. So I told him where to find you, but I but he looked stricken when I mentioned Undermere. He said he doesn't come near towns at all if he can help it. He was headed west, at least I think he was. He said he was looking for the Win Winster Spring. I'll write this down for you. Anyway, that's my news. Did you find the plant that I wanted? Yeah, the common trous. I found it. Where is it? Yeah, but she didn't ask. Like, I gave her Aguria. Because it was like, give her Aguria or I think Fennet to make it go away. And I gave her Aguria. And Aguria is the one that makes it worse. Because you can't generally give people plants, just any plants. They have to ask for certain plants. If you try to give them the wrong one, you will take a hit to your employee of the month rating. And that will make you go insane. Yeah, it's this one, right? Yep, that's a common house. Okay, let me label you first before I leave. Man wanted to meet you headed west from Sedberg, possibly near the river near the source of the River Winston. Okay. Near the River Winstern. Sedberg, Sedberg. Constant water. Sedberg, Sedberg. Sedberg. Where are you, Sedberg? White Sear Cave. Sedberg, there. Oh, here we go. So he said that he wanted to meet me. No, stop. Get out of the way. Out of the way. Headed west from Sedberg near the source of the River Winston. Okay. 
So near the source of the river Winster, River Sprint, River Kent, west of Sedberg. River Winster, there we go. What? Oh, he means this one, okay. Darn it. Alright, I got a water. No, never mind me first. I'm not long for this world and I have decided that I want to be buried in a grave decorated with the rare and beautiful Kabalia, like a drear huntsman with the dranthium covered tombs. Metal, I can appreciate that. Kabalia. Kabalia flowers all contain six petals, finding seven petaled flowers considered to bring good fortune. So I'm looking for a six petaled flower. This is a six petal flower. Collect. I am so good. Kabalia. You are Kabalia. Yeah, because apparently if I don't get the Employer of the Month bonus, I lose my mind. Like, he, uh, I have to fix. I get mind broken and I have to fix it. It's that important for a witch to be considered employee of the month, apparently. River Winston. The hermit's camp was easy to find, nestled between two boulders above the spring. The cool remains of a fire ringed by stones is the only immediate sign that anyone was here. I call out, but there is no reply. The hermit is not here. I to th down two right three. Okay. So I have to explore again. River Winston. Uh one, two, one, two, three. The camp at the Winston Spring has led me to another camp of an of sorts where I greeted by an eccentric man. Oh yes. Ho ho ho. Oh it's Santa Claus. Ho ho. The man says, you must take this, take it, take it. And in his, at his insistence, I receive a looking glass that he thrusts into my hands. He places an envelope delicately on top. Ho oh, ho, it's no use to me anymore. Ho oh, ho, no use. Don't forget the red, the red, the red, the red. Ho oh, oh, ho, abony. I'm quite sure that he, I'm sure that he is quite mad. <gasps> What's this? It is said that the red abony plant is a property of uncovering that which is hidden or secret. I have perfected a device designed to use to extract it from plants in concrete with viewing window in order to permit the user to see the magics otherwise invisible to the naked eye. Okay. What? Okay. From the plant in concrete, in concert with the viewing window, in order to permit the user to see magics otherwise invisible. So the red abony, right? Okay, let, let's put you away for now. The red abony. I have no information on the red abony. Okay, so close you. Put you in the archive. Are you the red ebony? Maybe it only works with microscope. Yeah, I think so. Wait, let's put something here. No, I can't put it above the microscope. Oh, I have to drag the plant here. Oh. Yeah, that damages my brain for some reason. Fine, so I have to figure out what the red abony is first, and then I can put it there. Oh, it's the woman with the jade mask. Your reputation is growing, horticulturist. I hear you are a person to come to for plants that are difficult to acquire. My head feels like it's being torn in too lately. I'm looking for some hop heart. Right, okay, let's let, let's get you some hop heart. What the heck is that emote? Hop heart. Hop heart. There we go. Inhaling smoke from the burning dried leaves of this plant can provide pain relief. Firm leaves grow up from the stems, leading to blue flowers. Alright, so it's blue flowers. Firm leaves. 
No. For leaves, blue flowers, that's also not what it looks like. Grow up from the stems leading to blue flowers. Well, that's Lady of Summer. Sweet rhubarb. Nope. That wasn't top part. Okay, I need to be more careful. Dried leaves of this plant can provide pain relief. Firm leaves grow up the stems leading to blue flowers. Okay, so it's a blue flower with with leaves along the stem. So that's not it, that's not it, that's not it, that's not it. Next one. Blue flower, firm leaf. So yeah, okay, maybe this is the hot part. Maybe I'm dumb. All right, let's let's go. He's planted. Okay, that's the right one. Thank God. Copper Caledonian. This proper this has a rejuvenation effect, but most who have tried to benefit from its properties have come to realize that it's a curse, not a blessing. You may appear younger, but you'll clearly be more frail and brittle. Okay. Hang on. Hop heart. I should label the hop heart. I have already forgotten which one is the hop heart. Uh oh. Uh, where, which one was the hop heart? Whoops. Give me a second. I need to figure out which one I just used. That one got me into trouble. Hop heart. Hop heart. Uh oh. Yeah, this one. This one's the hop heart, right? Yeah, that's the hop heart. Hop heart. No labels run. Let's go. Okay. I need to put you away first because I don't think I can use you yet. Reuben Ward has called on my unique expertise to aid in his investigation of the Swinside Stone Circle. Unique expertise? Ha! He knows how to flatter an old woman when he wants something. I thought about telling him to suck an egg. Give it a good long thought, actually, but my curiosity has got the better of me. He must be desperate if he's coming to me, and I bet they'll have found something juicy down there. Science of ritual sacrifice, maybe. I could do some with witch fuck. Do some witch fig take with me. Always comes in useful. Do I have witch fig? Fig. Oh, there. The plant that is said to have many uses, including so moisture detecting, is similar to the fever kiss plant, which is often confused with. Uh oh. Fever kiss. The red berries provide an energy boost. The leaves are pale in color. Okay, so this is probably the fever kiss. Because this is the leaves are pale in color. Hang on. Small red berries. Uh, let me put my berry plants beside each other so that I can figure out which is which. What? This is probably the fever kiss. So what's the one that looks like it? Uh-oh. Uh, what's the name again? Witch fig. I need the witch fig. 
Anthracetaminiusus, it has similar leaves to the fever kiss. So something with the similar leaves to this one. Uh, it has to have fruit. Oh, okay, so this is it. Small yellow berries. I'm so good. Okay. We are so back. Which fig? And I also might as well label the other one. Fever kiss. I never see I never see anybody in your shop. What the hell are you talking about? It's they surprise me. Fuck you. You believe me, I wouldn't be in here if I didn't have especially with damn cat still here. You get out. Bishop's parasol, work-related matter. I hate you. Bishop's parasol for a work-related matter. Okay. A mushroom found in dark, damp places feeding on any light. The gills and others that receive a milky fluid you can consume as treatment for stomach pains. I hope your ulcers get worse. Royal Gentria. I hope you get sick. I'm so sad that you can't poison people in this game. It's been it's been so hard. You know, I tried to be a good employee and then these people are like, Yo, we hate your cat. You, your, your store sucks. Sometimes you just want to poison somebody. The old man of Coniston looks out across the lake with blind eyes. His mind wanders with a current floating gently southwards to the fork. Not long after the girl left her home, her father wept, but he was so caught up in his own grief that he let her go and did not look for her. Oh, it's the sound of rain again. Old man of Coniston looks across the lake down towards the fork. The heavens open up as I reach the fork. I take a moment to pause and listen to the sound of water on water. I'm soaked through, but my spirits are high as I return home. I am not empty-handed. Two new plans today. This game is chill. It's fun. Uh, let's see. Oh, right. The insects make the salt marshes uninhabitable. People stay away and not much grows there, but I know where to find an unusual plant. I've drawn you a map in case you decide it's worth your time. What the heck? This is such a bad map. Like, where is this even? Near the ocean? Yeah, okay, I see it now. I see it now. It's near this border. It's up here. Okay. Winter boar. Winter boar. I'm pretty sure I identified the winter boar already. I have not. Blue gray flowers, winter boar rubbery leaves, infected. Okay, blue gray flowers, the winter boar. Light purple flowers, that's not you. Dark purple flowers, not you either. Rather unpleasant. Blue aloe. Oh, crap. I hope it works. Mm hmm. Here we go. This is probably the winter boar. Gray blue flowers. Use plant. The blue winter saves my skin, but the swirling mass of insects so thick in places it's hard to see. At length, I come across what I came for and hurry away. New plant acquired. Hang on. Let me label my winter boar. Winter boar. Thank you. 
Thank you for your help and discretion earlier. The sister is grateful, but the news that Arda was poisoned with gilded dendra is everyone worried. The temporary acting Arda is panicking. I, I probably shouldn't be telling you this, but one of the sisters has gone missing a runaway called Thea that we took in a few years ago. We're trying to find her and Sister Charlotte remember that Jacob's Worth plant is set to help locate people. Give me a moment. Jacob's Worth. Jacob's Worth. Jacob's Worth. People tend to be drawn to the unusual flowers by Jacob's Worth, but it's the leaves that has the most interesting properties. They set the point towards any person you wish to locate and have been used successfully to find many a lost wanderer out on the fells. Okay, I gotta look for something that has leaves that look like that. Unusual flowers and leaves that look like that. Oh. Is this it? Yeah, there we go. I'm so smart. Solomon Scepter. Some of these plants have really cool names. my wife's birthday and I wanted to get her something special. There's a plant she used to love as a child but she hasn't been able to find any in years. It's sort of a bulb-like and has strong smell to it but strong in a good way. And oh, the flower is more like lots of little flowers. You know what? You suck at describing things but I get what you're trying to do. It is bulb-like. Bulb like with many flowers. So I have a I have to look for my bulbs. Is this it? Forest Camphrey. Okay. That's what you are. Ah, uh, wait, I put this in the archive. We had our eye on you for some time now. Join us. Praise Dendru. I thought it said praise Andrew. I said, who the heck is that? I represent a group called the Seeds of Redemption. Your expertise would be very useful to us and we have much to offer in return. Let us know we can count on you by leaving a single St. John's poppy flower outside the sad gill curtain before Friday. Do not mistake, make the mistake of ignoring us. Praise the Dendru. Okay, on the one hand, I could totally do this and it would be cool. On the other hand, they're threatening me. And I don't like it when I'm being threatened. When I'm being threatened, I want to fight back. St. John's Poppy. St. John's Poppy. Yeah, I identified that, right? St. John's Poppy. Bright red with a yellow center. I think this is the St. John's Poppy. Yeah, did I forget the label of St. John's Poppy? Oopsies. Well, I only have like one flower that looks like that. It's bright red with yellow center. So I should probably label it. St. John's Poppy. What do you guys think? Should I join their group? He threatened me. Well, I have it till Friday. So, you know. Do tomorrow, do tomorrow. I have returned from Swinside. I must admit, I was hoping for more to go on with certain signs which have been performed at the Stone Circle. And the poor victim, well, the less said about him, the better. Ruben had bright yellow, personally. I had the beginnings of a theory, but I'd like to run some tests on a sample of Gilded Dendra. Where is my Gilded Dendra? They do sound like the flower Illuminati. Do not drink the sap of this plant, the lips will, Okay, yeah, it'll kill you. The poison so point touching the leaves of the plant can be painful. I know I had a plant like that earlier, and it, just touching it hurt. Yeah. There we go. I am so good at this maiden sorrow. My aunt died two weeks ago and I inherited her house. I've been sifting through her possessions last night and I found possessions last night and I found something unusual. In a forgotten corner of the attic I found That is a weird thing to have in the in your attic, but okay, more unusual still it was my strong vines, so strong I cannot cut through them. I immediately thought of your shop. 
You know about plants, right? Yeah, I know about plants. It's a it's a plant shop. What do you expect? The Royal Gentia. Something's called the Everheart Pink. Oh, I know that one. Royal Gentia. Oh. oh, I already finished the day, huh? I'm getting much faster at this. Where's my labels? Royal Gentia. And day. Should I mess with the flower Illuminati or not? Five miles south of the tallest, but five miles south of the tallest, but one tallest but one. It grows in peace in the midday sun. Five miles south of the tallest but one. Before she left, she returned to her hiding place and carefully retrieved the book, her excitement building as she did. She couldn't articulate what was so alluring to her about the book, but by now it had become an obsession. I have one day before Flower Illuminati comes get me. Five miles south of the tallest one. Five miles south of the tallest one. The tallest one is Bofell. One, two, three, four, five. Nothing here, darn. I guess I can do that. I just don't want to like be roped into the. I, to me, having no choice. But to like go with their stuff because they like, oh, you have to. And would I was able to strip away the swiftness vines and lift the lid with more than a little trepidation, I'll admit. To my relief, but also disappointment, the coffin contained nothing but dust. At least that's what it looked like in first bad post infection. I discovered a golden amulet embedded in gray ash. On the back of the description, it reads, With Solomon's Scepter, I awake. Solomon's Scepter, that's a plant, right? Yeah. On, let me look for my Solomon Scepter. Also, an alarm, also known alarmingly as Hell's Gate and sometimes Solomon's Scorn. The flowers of the plant are commonly used in witchcraft and other satanic practices. Many sweet small, smelling small flowers grow along the stem. Along the stem, many flowers. Hang on. Along the stem, many flowers. Along the stem, many flowers. Huh. Do I have anything like that, actually? It's gone, you. I mean, this one looks like it has many flowers. Right? Yeah, I think this is it. This is the Solomon Scepter. Oh, I'm so good. We are so back. Okay. Solomon Scepter. Solomon Scepter. Okay. Five miles south of the tallest but one. Oh, it's the tallest but one. So it's the second tallest, okay. No, but that was right then, both fell. Zero miles south, one mile, two miles, three miles, four miles. Oh, it's over here. The forest here is lush and vibrant. The bird song feels enchanting like a call of sirens. Nestled in the undergrowth, the shade of the birch tree, a plant grows. Yeah, that's a stinky flower. Okay, fine. I will join the flower Illuminati. The seeds of redemption. St. John's Poppy. Sad Jill Church. Okay, uh... I don't have the will to explore. 
Where'd my watering can go? There we go. Praise the Andrew! Lady of Summer. Watering flowers can be very relaxing. Where is my succulent actually? I mean, I know I said earlier that I dropped it, but that doesn't mean it died. Uh, sorry, where is it supposed to go again? Redemption. Sad, sad guild church for Friday. Sad guild church. Sad guild church. Sad guild church. Sad guild church. Where are you, sad? Okay, sad guild church. Oh. Trish is hard to find. I need to put St. John's Poppy in there. Plant identified. St. John's Pop? Alright. <sighs> David Schaefer. I heard a shepherd got killed by some wild beast up near the Swinside Stone Circle. They say it slaughtered half its flock as well. People around here don't seem too bothered, but it's got them panic down Foxfield anyway. Foxfield Way. Foxfield Way. Kent Mere Eye. Kent Mere Eye. Kent Mere Eye. Kent Mere Eye. Where's Kent Mere Eye? Foxfield. Kent. That's Foxfield. I have to go to Kent Mere Eye. There, Kent Mere Eye. I descend to the Pleasant Valley. Kentmere is situated. On my way. Oh, wait. I have to put these away. I have to keep putting away letters. Ah, no. Kentmere I. I make a beeline to the church. There are many plants to admire when I have stones, but sadly, nothing extraordinary for me to find today. Kentmere I. Huh. Can't near I Oh, I have neither the time or the inclination. Where is the Kent near I? Also need to read this one again. Okay, I don't have the red abony though. Okay. Well, this is getting interesting. I was able to confirm that there was deep gilded dendro that was used at a swim side ritual site. What the, that's a worrying sign. It's a plant that's used to several darker incantations. There must be a connection between this other murder and the sisterhood. I need some mental clarity to think through it more. Some maiden sorrow would help a lot. Maiden sorrow? Rubbing the soft leaves of this plant between one's fingers and thumb is said to help prevent the mind from wandering, providing a focusing effect. The flowers of this plant droop mournfully, but it's the thorns along the stem that thought lend its name. Right, so a drooping flower with thorns along its stem. No, that's the Lady of Summer. That's the Gilded Dendra. Drooping flower, thorns along its stem. There we go, that's the Maiden Sorrow. Red Abony, there we go. A plant said on cover hidden. Red Abony is extremely rare and not well studied. Blood has been spilled. This plant is just where the red part is believed to come from since confusingly the large flower is in fact blue. Okay, hang on. Maiden Sorrow. So, yeah, that's fine. That's what I meant to put. That's fine. That, that that's correct. Kentmere Eye. Eye of Kentmere. But where would the Eye of Kentmere be? Does it mean here in the eye row of Kentmere? Mm. 
Uh, no, that's not it. Uh, let's see. Oh, maybe it's... This is what it means. The Eye of Kentmere. Yeah, down here, down the bottom right. It looks like I'm going to have to make a trip to Black Home. Verona noticed something at the Swinside site that's had me pondering. A piece of slate with a symbol drawn on it in black. I can't think of anywhere else around from where you'd get that slate from. That and Bradley Miller keeps insisting that he saw something up at Black Home. But then again, Bradley Miller does claim that Fairy stole his wheelbarrow. If I'm going to spend the night on the hills, I want to take some eye bright with me. I wouldn't want anyone sneaking up with me in the dark. Eye bright. Pillows this flower can be brewed. In a oh no, that's different. Not that bright colored thorns, they'll do no lasting damage, but they get a small amount of venom, which will cause severe pain for several days after. Plant only grows in the south. No one can improve eyesight. Okay, so it's a thorny plant. It has thorns. Eye bright. Wild coal. Eye bright. Is it possible that this one is the... Is it possible that it's you? There we go. Oh, I can find hidden texts. Oh! Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on, hang on, wait. Wait, can't your eye. No, shut up. There's nothing here. Okay. No, shut up. Yeah, okay, I get that, but... What do you do? Huh? It all glows. That doesn't help me at all. Where's my map? Oh, property of Nicholas Oh. Hang on. The Great Oak. Tomb of the Hunter. Elder Finium grows here. Oh, there's a lot that I haven't covered. Okay, that's great. This is good. This is good. This is... I don't know what the Eye of Kentmere is, but... Okay. The Great Oak is down here, okay. The huge tree stands before me, impossibly tall, wide, and bigger could I ever imagine. Its upper branches retrace the sky. Okay, I couldn't do anything with that. Uh, wait, but how about on the book? Is there anything on the book? There doesn't seem to be. Hang on, what about this one? On the flower, is there anything on it? It w Shut up! Okay, wait, let me look at some of the other stuff. Elder Finnum grows here. Yeah, okay, I'll go down there. Okay, after you find. Did it ever stop raining in Undermere? Yes, yesterday. I have a reputation in town for knowing about unusual plants. I need some gray sand fire. Nobody on you know what I'm talking about, but I hope I'm in the right place. Well, you've come to the right place. I know I have that somewhere. Give me a moment. Um, no. That's not what I want. No. Affinium. Gray sand fire there. Sapphire is tough outer bark, which is many useful properties. Some chew on it, from a little hygiene flame, like tendrils give a smoky scent. Yeah, all right, here we go. Great sapphire. Ember sword. No, I'm not done. Hang on. Great sapphire. 
I want to continue looking. Nicholas Culp Culpepper. Wait, hang on. According to the map, where are you? No, not that. According to the map, down here. So, whoever wrote on my map has been very helpful. It would never have thought. Oh, oh there we go. Elder Finium. That's what it's called, if I remember correctly. So, what else? Elder Finium. Elder Finium. Tomb of the Hunter. Okay, where's the new plant? Where they put the new plant? Here. Uh, I still haven't found the eye of Kentmere. I still don't know what this one's about. Wait, hang on. Three. Five. No, I thought there was something to do with this one. Okay, but no, apparently not. Maybe there's something on my desk that I didn't see because it's covered with crap. That's a wet stain. Uh, I I still want to find the Kent in your eye. So wait, but then I'll go Tomb of the Hunter, which is 14 B, B14. Oh, okay, there we go. Uh, can't near eye, can't near eye. Over here. This is Kent near I. That little patch of forest over there. Ugh, oh, let me let me water some plants so I can get get out faster. Let's see. Kentmere in this little patch of forest. No, it's not it. What the heck? Kentmere. Is it the houses that I have to be in? Is it this little thing? I don't even know if I have the right idea. Was that, where was it again? Can't near. If I have this thing in the shot. It's over here. Okay, let's try this one. Just beside it. Just a little bit to the right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
From Kentmere, I follow the bearing of the eye and end up in a small forest north of Kendall. The woods are thick with briar, but mom also... I got it. I was right. I am... Brain cell is running at 1,000% capacity right now. You go to the archive. And you go here. And they... Oh, right. Sorry, I was supposed to click that. Lowick at Ilgil Head. Foxfield to Crinkle Crags. At first, she felt free, but it wasn't long before the reality of her situation began to take its toll. She stole food when she was hungry and slept in makeshift shelters, not knowing where she was going, not caring. Eventually, she made her way to Grisdale Forest. Friday. Lowick to Ilkil Head. Lowick to Ilkil Head. Lowick. Where is Ilkil Head? I thought this one said Jover. Lowick to Ilkil Head. Ilgil head. It's Moncaster. Okay, it's Lowick the Ilgil head. I see it. It's over here. Lowick the Ilgil head. I think I have to draw an X with the positions. Lowick the Foxfield the Crinkle Crags. Lowick the Ilgil head. Foxfield the Crinkle Crags. Crinkle Crags is here. Where's Foxfield? Foxfield is here. So it's. Crags to Foxfield, it'll go ahead to Lowick. So it's going to be hmm. Okay, it's gonna be here near Torver. Nothing here. Damn it. I missed it. It's in that area. It's in that area. Because uh, okay, anyway, let's let's get let's get some customers in here. Wait, am I even getting paid? You were wise to pledge your support to the seeds of redemption. Together we are stronger. Now that Ren threw us awoke and redemption is upon us, it is a glorious time. Our deeds will be remembered for a thousand years. Those of us who have put our faith in the woken Dendru will be saved, but we must act swiftly. We will be in touch soon. Praise Dendru. Okay. Unknown. My mind is clouded, dark. It, I see it and it sees me, all of me. And their finium is the answer it must be. I will not forget those who helped me, horticulturist. Elder finium. Where did I put you? I was so proud of getting you. Where did I put you? Wait, did you disappear? Where'd you go? Oh, here. Collect. Lark shine. Oh, who's this? My mom was into horticulture. I found this among her things. Golden light. That's a plant, right? I'm not sure what long might could mean though. Is that another plant? Any case, I thought you should have any. It, if you should have it, just in any case, it will help. She loved this shop. Golden light. Start at long meg S two E two. Wait, but I need to get. Where's my ruler? I need to draw a line. Give me like a, uh... Where is my string? There we go. Ow. Ow! Okay. We're going analog. I got my string. Okay, so it's going to be... Loic to Ilgil head. Okay. You. There we go. The magpie sees me before I see it. I do not know how long it has been watching me, but I can tell that it is interested in my movements. A strange sensation creeps over me, and I feel an urge to leave this place, but not before collecting the plant for further study. One for sorrow. 
Turning to leave, I see another magpie and another plant I've never seen before. Two for joy. So I need to go to Golden Light, start at Long Meg, S3E2. Start at Long Meg. Long Meg. That's not a place, is it? Golden Light, start at Long Meg. Oh wait, let me check my books. Start at Long Meg. I have a long meg. Long Vericon, which is from the Long Vericon is believed to know. Start at Long Meg. S3 to find. Help me! The amulet! I can't remove it and it's drawing the life for me! Long Vericon. That's just what I was looking at. Small leaves grow in pairs along the stem. Small leaves grow in pairs along the stem. So I need plants with pair with uh, leaves along the stem. Meek Juno, Hop Heart. No, no, that's not it. Grow in pairs along the stem. Long leaves grow in pairs along the stem. I want its fox button. What was that noise? Growing in pairs along the stem. Oh, hang on. Long Vericund. Ah, no, out of the way. Sometimes called which Long Vericund is believed to lift curses. Small leaves grow in pairs along the stem. I didn't see this one. But this one's already hop heart. So yeah, it's probably this one then. The one that I said. Yeah. There we go. That's a long very good. I can feel it working. Thank you. All right, very good. Long very good. Call Rotary. Long very good. Good to see you, my friend. I've been on the road so long, I started to wonder if you were still on the other end of the letters I've been sending. I'm back in town for a few days though, and I wanted to give you some of these before I forgot. I found them in the pocket of an overcoat that belonged to your uncle. I almost threw them away, but I thought the symbols on them might mean something to you. Oh, come on. You didn't even arrange them the way I needed- Okay. Where are you? Oh, don't tell me that this is this is what I'm supposed to do. Hang on. You get off the desk for now. You get off the desk too. That fits into that, that fits into that, this fits into this. This fits into that. Yeah, this fits into that. So six, five, four. Come on, tell me. Oh, that jump scared me. Goss fourth. A briar's disc, often called a smuggler, is a simple device that can be used to send coded messages. The location of a cached cargo, for example, the principle is cunningly straightforward, but the code is undecipherable. The prying eyes. Both parties must be in possession of a disc of identical size with the same symbols etched around its edges. And a map. To encode the location, you would then place the disc over some name point. Oh, 
like, yeah, I, I figured that out already. I figured that out. Robert Barrow's Medic Medicinal Herbology, Black Hall Road, Kendall. You go here too. Trimblehuff. And Devil's Night Trap. What if I. Black Hall Road, Kendall. What if I go to Kendall? I find the medicinal herbology shop of Black Hall Road. I know you, says the man behind the counter. Robert Barrow, presumably. You're the owner of Strange Horticulture. Two hours later, after lengthy and engaging discussion covering a variety of botanical subjects, we decide on a trade. It turns out that Robert's collected of unusual fungi, and I just have the thing for him. The Copper Caledonian. Where are you, Copper Caledonian? The red patches are often seen growing on it are a fact type of fungus themselves and are not part of the plant. No, that's the wandering view. This one looks like the copper caledonian. Red warts growing on it. There we go. I'm so good at this game. I'm good at identifying plants. I'm gonna quit my job and become a horticulturist. Uh, copper caledonian. Whoops. So I need to go to Golden Light, start at Long Meg. Long Meg. Is there any place here that has letters of Long Meg? Arnside and Moore, Sandberg, Tebai, Harnkrag, Kentmere, Ambleside, Vendermere, Long Meg. Where are you, Long Meg? Wait a minute. It's a plant, right? No, there's no plant here. I don't need these either anymore. But I think I might need... Where's the other one? Oh. Yeah, since this thing is not lit up yet, I think it means that I can still use it. Golden light start at long meg. Uh, let's see. Agramont, Gosforth, Red Pike, Fairfield, Grassmere Royal. Long Meg. I don't have a Long Meg plant, do I? Because if I had a Long Meg plant, that would make sense. Dubai, Dark oh, that was a mistake. I did not mean to click that. Okay. Never mind. I wasted that. Alright. Ding. I have no idea what any of this is, but it seemed like something you might find interesting. I don't know, I found it here. Oh. Baylox Elixir, made from the crushed petals of three distinctive plants. Baylox Elixir is a potent it memory, allowing those who drink it to ensure that they retain important information that they will never forget. Care must be taken after drinking however to avoid the fate of Grey Guile, who slowly lost their mind after drinking Baylox and staring at a blank wall for 12 hours. In Tebay's, a noble elder stood silently watching starry skies. In Tebay. Yeah, that, that's definitely like directions. Okay, find Tebay first. Tebe, 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 Tebe. There, Tebe. In Tebe, a noble elder stood silently watching starry skies. In Tebe, a noble elder stood silently watching starry skies. Okay, 
this mouth information over here to be in to be a noble elder stood silently watching starry skies i find myself on a patch of moorland surrounded by jagged peaks and menacing clouds a distinctive plant stands out against the swaths of purple heather and there another Put this away first. Long Meg? Sorry, I haven't heard of that, but I'll keep an eye out for you in the library. As long as you can get me some Fever Kiss, that is. Too many late nights at the labor library taking its toll. Fever Kiss. I feel like I identified that one. Red berries provide an energy boost that lasts several hours. Yeah, this is the berries plant. Where are you, Long? Where are you? I put the two of them beside each other, if I remember right. And I probably don't remember right. My memory is so bad. There, fever kiss. Mount- that's a can. Mountain Astory promotes the aura of confidence and persuasiveness. Large cup-like fries produce a stale, damp smell. There's talk around town of a woman who wears a green mask made of jade. There's small, all sorts of oddballs in Undermere, but that's certainly unusual. Beckfoot candle. Alright, I getcha. I'll bring out the, uh, no, not you. No, why'd you close? Beckfoot candle. Where's Beckfoot? Backfoot. Backfoot. Backfoot candle. Old man, Tarver Low Wakers. Where is that? Ghost Fort, Riven Glass, Bootle, Blackcomb, Haverick, Swinside. Backfoot, there we go. Backfoot and then candle. Okay, so it's. Right under the Seafall Pike. Candle leads me east of Westwater. To the north, the mighty Scalfell Pikes graces the sky. The tallest peak in England. The challenge beckons to me, perhaps another time. You get out. Forest ver Their eyes are so green, it's off-putting. I've been talking to people around town, trying to learn as much as I can about this beast that is rumored to have been seen in these parts. The old world, they called this thing the Servant, but the people here seem to have forgotten that name, except the group calling themselves the Seeds of Redemption. They, call they are something I did not expect, and they have made it clear that they want me to stay away from the Servant. They seem to worship it, but I'm getting distracted. My Dranthium supplies are low. I need more. What is Dranthium? Plant with a powerful mind altering ab Oh, it's weed. Someone who's drank it was the green eye, a name derived from the telltale sense of overdose where the white whites of the eyes take a green tint. Alright. Long sharp leaves coming right up. This has long sharp leaves. Dark purple flowers though are like the uh defining feature, so I don't think that's it. Has a scent that scratches the back of my throat. That one has long, sharp leaves. Purple flowers, long leaves. Okay, long leaves. Yeah, okay. It's probably this one. Yep, long sharp leaf. Ding. What's this one? Oh, I kept on the black comb two nights in the pitch back. I bite some potent stuff. I could see clear as day. Up on the fell, I found a shallow pit full of skulls. Some deer, fox, badger, and some human. There's an eerie science about the place to leave. Every part of me is screaming 
to get out of there. Back down the f on the flat, I heard a terrible noise, like an axe maker's whetstone, but unmistakably animal. High in the ridge line, I saw a cowed woman wearing a jade mask watching me, and beside her, something dark, inhuman, and bloody huge. I don't mind admitting that I'm out of my depth at this one. I'll need to speak to Verona again. While I'm here, I'll grab some wild coal for my pounding head. You'd have been out drinking too if you'd seen what I did. Wild coal. Oh, it's berries. Purple berries. Hair of the dog. Midly tonic. There is some wild coal. A sacred plant. Because of the rarity. It's bad luck to pick berries. I think this guy is going to die. They're going to give him like... Uh, they're going to make him eat it and he's going to die. Small purple red berries. Purple berries is what I'm looking for, right? Purple berries. No, that's not berries. Berries. Where are the berries? Purple red berries. Berries. That's not berries. Purple flowers. I think it's the only berries. Oh, are these berries? Red fruits. These are the berries. Berries. There we go. That's wild coal. Norwood. My, my plant collection is getting worse and worse. Wild coal. Hello. Well, this looks like the right place. I don't want to have to try traps all over the world to find red pikes. I'm hopefully you've got what I'm after. It's a non-flowering plant with smallish leaves and seems to grow mostly on red pike. At least that's the only place I've found it. Do I have that? Let's look at red pike here. I'm gonna teleport to red pike. Seafell pike. No, it's not red pike. Oh, that's not what I want to press. Um, red pike. Red pike. Do I have red pike? No, it's a non-flowering plant with smallish leaves and seems mostly on the red pike. It's a common trouse. Okay, non-flowering plant with small red leaves. With small leaves, sorry. Non-flowering. Small leaves, non-flowering plant, small leaves. I don't think I have that. I have to go to the red bike. But where is the red bike? This is the red bike. I enjoy a pleasant stroll up the fell, easy going with it. I do not have to look hard. I have already explored here and there is all I have to, and I found all that I have to find. What? It's a what? Okay. Hmm. It doesn't flower. And it has small leaves. Small-ish leaves, sorry. This side does this side has absolutely nothing. Um No, those are big leaves. That has flowers. That's not it. Uh, fox button, fever kiss, witch fig. Hint. It's a common trout. I'm gonna be so upset if it's a common trout. It is a common trout. God damn. Those are smallish leaves? Okay, whatever. Verona Green. Poor Ruben, he looks a little worse for wear this morning. He took it hard when his wife died and never did quite give up the drinking. I think I know the ritual was performed in the stone circle. It all adds up. It was a summoning spell. Someone called to something across the void and tried to bring it here. And with the state of that body all torn to shreds, I'd say they succeeded. And then the gilded dendra, that really got me thinking. I found this in Dr. Worthing's bestiary. A little light reading for you. I'm headed to Grisdale Forest again. Sisterhood will know more. It has many names. Some call it the Woken Dendru. Believing it to be related in some way to the deadly gilded dendro plant. Others call it the Night Stalker, the Miasma, or the Dread. But the most common name for it in the Shires is the Servant. You'll have heard of it. 
In children's songs such as Keep the Fire Burning and Servant and Master, there are hints of it in older stories, but nobody alive has seen it in the flesh. It is said that the dead ground northeast of Tebe, where nothing grows but black digitus mortis grows, was caused when the servant last walked in the lands hundreds of years ago. Northeast of Tebe. Northeast of Tebe. White dead man's field dark mushrooms. Collect. Can you plant a co Those are mushrooms. Digitatus mortis. All right, so let's call that what it is. Digitatus mortis. Digitatus mortis. Digitatus mortis. Every day she attentively followed the teachings of the Arda. Every day she patiently performed the tasks given to her. Every day she thought the thoughts of the book itched away at the back of her mind. Day 10, Sunday. Oh, this one's blank. A secret uncovered is a secret no more. Two miles north of Foxfield. Two miles north of Foxfield. That's very simple. If I can remember where Foxfield is there. One one mile. Two miles north of Foxfield. What? One one mile two. Alright, fine, whatever. One from your librarian friend today. Oh no, this is a long meg. In reference to your question the other day about the long meg, I'm afraid I do not have the answer, but Calder Abbey has a wealth of, inf of knowledge and local lore. If you ever go there, the monks will request a plant from me, but I won't tell you what they want. A sort of test. They've never allowed me in to look at their stacks. Simone. Calder Abbey. A small window opens from within. F only a friend may enter. Friend! Okay, wait, I remember what this one was. Ah, uh, where's that one? Hypnotic, no, often found skin rashes. Her plant, no. Cavillian cauldry, cauldry, no. Cavillia, no. It's the lock heart. Common, subs of red pike. Copper Caledonian and all oh, the Mickey Brittle. Corpse's friend, the Devil's Night Trap. This plant is known colloquially as the Corpse's friend. If ingested, the seed agonized light, pleasant smell, piney, was boiling the root in vinegar, it's tonic against poisons. Do I have this? The Devil's Night Trap. Light pleasant scent not dissimilar to pine needles. No. Light pleasant scent not dissimilar to pine needles. Rather unpleasant scent, no. Dark purple flowers, no. Pleasant fresh aroma. It smells like rhubarb. Sweet scent like strawberry dipped in honey. Light and buttery. Bright red flowers grow at the ends of the stems. I'm wary of those spines. Does it gentle scent? It needs to smell like pine. Musty books. Hmm. That's a common trouse. That's okay. Fox. Oh, come on. Why fox button? I 
Ah, because it's a token of friendship. Got it. Okay, where'd my fox button go? I mean, it's not really a hint if they just straight up tell you. Oh, oh well. I thought I was just gonna get a hint. Fox button. Fox button? Fox button. Okay. Snatch snapshot and the oak door swings inward slowly without sound. I am ushered in by a man wearing a plain brown robe. He nods silently when I ask what long Megan needs me to small abbey. There's a stone circle north of Undermere. According to the legend, some some hundreds, perhaps even thousands of years ago, a witch known as Long Meg lived nearby with her daughters. They were wild godless people. Wild godless people who practiced evil magic until one night they went too far and Meg and her daughters were turned to stone. A tall stone that stands apart from the main circle is called Long Meg by the locals. Okay, so I have to go to Undermere. Stone circle north of Undermere. I, okay. There's a stone circle north of Undermere. I don't see it. Oh, shut up. There's a stone circle north of Undermere. Golden light started long legs out three two. Where's the stone circle though? South 3, East 2. Well, it's time to start blasting. Sun 1, 2, 3, East 2. There is his stone circle north of dot. Oh, there you go. South 3, East 2. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2. The river is in its youth here. Oh, there we go. It's called the Golden Light. Where'd it go? Where did it go? just throws the plants in here. I, I lose them so quickly because of that. Oh god, okay. Which one was it? Whoops, I lost it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Is this it? Oh no. Oh no, I lost it. Whoopsies. Yeah, I'll figure out which one it is. The Golden Glow. I'll figure it out, don't worry about it. Oh, sorry, I forgot about this one. Two miles north of Foxfield, so. Whoops. I think it's this one. I may be mistaken. Is this where they're trying my patience again? And if the old Arda was around, but she's not. They've kept their secret for hundreds of years. If ever there's a time to share them, it is now. They know of a way to defeat the servant, some ritual or weapon or something, but their stubborn pride won't help won't bring them to ask for help. Well, I won't sit idly by and do nothing. I'd better have a little chat with this new Arda, and I think I'll take some Mountain Astery with me. M is for Mountain Astery. Large cup of flowers produce a stale, damp smell. It's a cup of flowers. Cup of flowers, stale, damp smell. Large blue flower with an odd protrusion. Stick of smell. Yeah, I think this is it. Yep, there we go. That's the mountain astery. Weeping bell. Then a 
mastery. There we go. It's Thomas Green. I have finished the designs you asked me to work on. Be very careful unwrapping these. Some of the glasswork is still quite delicate and everything. Taken great care of transporting them. My lab equipment is fine here. I'll now be able to brew elixirs using ingredients from my plants. There we go. So it's time to make this one. This one would record. Okay, get out of the way. Do any of these facts look familiar? Uh oh. Iberia. Wait, hang on. Okay, this would be easier if the descriptions match the image, but okay. So I need a, an 8-petal flower and a 5-petal flower that looks like that. Alright, okay. No, that 5-petal looks off. This one looks right. Okay, and then, yeah, I think this one too is correct. And then last but not the least, I need the one that has... Uh oh, wait, maybe this is the one. Not this one. Yeah, I think the, the, it matches better. Is it the winter boar? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. No, that's way too much. Now we're making elixirs. I think this one's it, the eye bright. Yeah, the eye bright. Create an elixir. I made the Baylox elixir. The master brewer. This is just potion master all over again. I was really good at that game. Oh, okay, wait. I keep forgetting to look for this one. Two miles north of Foxfield. One, two. We are even circling above the cost and croaks, leak, caving the silence. And all mine, I take what I came for and breathe. What's this one? Patterson's Guide to Fatal Fungi and Their Antidotes. Spring wax caps, sometimes fatal, can usually be cured by taking hop heart boiled in vinegar. Sunset Mount Cap, generally not fatal in small doses. Use crushed leaves from sand, sour brandy to cure. Bishop's Parasol, often fatal, can be remedied with a lemon sap from Lemon Dandy. Often fatal, no known cure. Often fatal, an antidote can be made using Royal Gentia. Alright. So let's go back here. Oh, sorry, hang on. I spoke with the Verona Green earlier, it's bad. If the Dendru has awoken, then it will come for us. You must place an offering at the altar of Arduina. What the heck? Okay, wait. Where is that? Mountains separated by a... What? Hang on. No, get out the way. There. So there's gonna be two churches, two abbeys. Abbeys and mountains. Two mountains separated. Oh, that's not it. Two mountains separated by. No, it's Ilgil Head. There needs to be a church. Two mountains separated by Kentmere? No. Where is this? Could you have not just told me where? Okay. So, is it an abbey? Okay. So, I have to find 
something that looks like this separated by that line I'm looking for like nearly vertical lines here this one okay if this is it then no it's not it the 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 the, the mountain side is shaped differently like it curves somewhat around the mountain hang on let's see if the mountain is over here wait so it needs to cut it needs to cut through between two mountain ranges we know that one and then there has to be these two houses where are you? Make an offering down there. Huh. No, there's nothing on you. Like, I think the closest... No, that's not that close either. No. Hmm. Let's see. Where are you? It's some two mountains separated by a river. And the river curves away. You are the worst at drawing maps. Hang on. Just that bump. Oh, you're kidding me. This is it. I found it. At the foot of this mountain. Okay. I found it. Your maps suck. I found it. It seems Beth has been able to keep her fellow sisters away from the inspired fires. For now, at least. But these, are, these are thick. Okay. Well, here too, our seems to belong here is part of the forest, gnarled trunks, and twisting roots. It must be an offering to the goddess Arduina. So let's look first at Caldery. Caldery, not well known, epic dark magic, neither substance. Those who worship the huntress Arduina places flowers an offering to ensure a successful hunt. It grows from a thin stem with small leaves. Alright, this one's it. But what's the other one? Ember Soul. What would happen if I put Ember Soul? Because you have two options here. Ember Soul, what does this say? Thought of protective properties given to various. Produces flower. Return for sanctuary. No, I should give the one that's like. Uh, Caldery. No, why did you open? Caldery. So it's. Those who worship the Hunter's Alduina. Okay, Caldery. Place the flowers as an offering to ensure a successful hunt. It grows from a thin stem with small leaves. Are we asking for a successful hunt? Hang on. Ember soul. We want this protection, right? Yeah, let's get let's let's do the ember soul. I think this one is like more appropriate. Because, like, the other one is, like, to ensure a hunt, but we're not hunting. Right? If we're hunting... Oh, wait. What's this? Oh, that's the elixir I made. Okay. Ember soul. Animal ignis. Oops. No, get out of the way. Hmm. The leaves are razor sharp. Alright, that's Kabali. Okay. Many. That has so many petals. Hmm. 
and you need very sharp leaves. Okay, no. Hang on. Pleasant fresh aroma. Smell pleasant. Hang on, hint. <laughs> oh, okay, so it has to be Ember Soul. Oh, I was right about that, I guess. It's not this one, because that's St. John's Poppy. Or this one. What's this one? Yeah, this one's the sharp use one. It's this one. Evilum. Get out. Animal Ignis. Uh, let me label this one, though. Uh, where's that? Uh, over here. Ember Soul. Ember Soul. I'm being harassed by loonies. Shouting about the redemption, saying that they're going to set it free, whatever the hell that means. Well, they can take their seeds of whatever woken something or other nonsense and stick it where the sun don't shine. I'm not joining their damn cult. I just want to tend to my garden in peace. I'm looking for some lark shine to drive them away if they come around again. Lark shine, lark shine. Lark shine. Lark shine. Lark shine is a plant with a powerful defense mechanism. It is staying bar was triggered by a light touch. The pain can be said to be unbearable in glass for several days. Sometimes confused between called kidney flower. This is thought to be a reference to the kidney shaped seeds held within the spiny pods that grow on this plant. Spiny pods. Spiny pods, there we go. Lark shine. Where's my labels? There. Lark shine. Oh, oh, sorry. That's done. End day. What oh, has holes? 902803X. In time, she learned that the sisterhood had secrets. Or had she always known that? Had she come to them by chance or had she sought them out deliberately? She wasn't sure, but by now she knew what she wanted and she would do anything to get it. Day 11, Monday. 902803 902803 16 and okay crinkle crags 16 the impressive ridge line of the crinkle crags stretches across the full width of my vision days like today are worth being alive for a colorful plant stands amongst the moss new plant acquired let's see uh, okay the old man reckons there's a plant where you can find Pots of gold buried underground. Don't know what it's called, but I bet you do. Tell you what, I'm rich and I'll throw a share of gold your way. Okay. Weepin Bell. It's a Pokemon. The plant said to believe to have le led to gold. You'll have to bought as much luck searching for the end of a rainbow. The soft fruit leaves can soothe insect bites and stings. It's also known as golden light and sometimes April Fool's Hope. Uh, uh, Fool's Hope. April Fool's Hope. Golden light. Yeah, that's the one earlier. The one that I lost, the one that I can't figure out what it is. I think this is it. Red flowers, soft leaves. There we go. Here's the plant. A weeping bell. A weeping bell. Weeping bell. Ennis Aylford. I have a task for you that would greatly aid the seeds of redemption. One of the Dreer is in town and I know he's paid you a visit already, no doubt feeding his habitat. We suspect he's here to hunt the Dendru. If he returns, give him some of this. He'll make a worthy sacrifice to the Dendru. Let's help him on his way. Oh, so I can screw them over. I 
I'm heading out in the road again, but before I leave, I wanted to store some valuables in a safe. I don't trust myself to remember the combination. I certainly don't trust myself to write it down anywhere and not to lose it. This is where you come in. Surely you have something up your sleeve for me. Yeah, I got some Baylock's elixir for you. Spring wax cap. Baylock's elixir. Please help me, I lost my dog while walking out in the fells. The mist rolled in and he was gone. I could I remember there was a plant that could help find people. I wonder if it works for dogs. It's unusual black and golden flowers. Yeah, I remember that one. Where are you? Black and golden flowers. This one. The Jacobsworth. We're just bl blowing through these now. Oh, goodness, Hellbore. Have you been getting enough food? That's terrible. What will ever become of you? My mother had me look into the ser servant kitchen for you, but I'm afraid I've not been getting anywhere. It's strange. I'm sure I've seen some references before, but I'm drawing a blank when I try to find anything. I think Lord Freeman's archives would be a good place to look. I was going to post this to you, but I... <coughs> Sorry. Sorry. That and sneak in some hellbore hugs. I've not been getting anywhere looking through my collections of Ambleside for any mention of the servant, but Lord Fremont's archives at Mooncaster are home to many ancient and esoteric schools covering a wide variety of it might be worth a visit. Muncaster. Where's Muncaster? Muncaster. Muncaster? I'm usually very... Mm, there we go, Muncaster Castle. I followed Freeman's manservant to the vaults of the castle. Two hours later, I still found no mention of the servant on the verge of giving up. A name grabs my attention. The Woken Dendru. Didn't Verona say that that was another name for the servant? The Woken Dendru is loyal to the summoner who it becomes its master and can bend its terrible power to their will. This servant is assumed to be immortal since it has no known vulnerabilities, but that does not mean that it cannot be defeated. Many hundreds of years ago, a site of ritual importance was created near Black Combe. To the south of the Watcher, the Great Oak, and the Dendru was ousted. The, the great, south of the Watcher, the Great Oak. Okay, yeah, I saw the Great Oak, and it was ousted from this world. Unfortunately, we know, we know that five plants were required for the ritual, and specific plants are not known. Okay, I can screw it over. All right, Norwood, please. It's the only thing that I can keep me from nodding off in the night shift. All right. It's like there's this entire plot of a monster attacking the village and all the people and cults and like this guy's just like I I don't want to fall asleep during my job. And you know what? More power to him. It's part of the grind. A bit of crunchy root is fine for the fact of cold bucket of water coming out of the face. Skin that really is powerful spores are invisible to the naked eye, showing up only under a natural light. Is this it? A small amount of light. Is this how this works? Oh, there we go. Okay. There we go. So that's Norwood. I'm so smart. I thought about that one, Daisy Doc. Oh, it's already done for the day? Okay. Uh, let's just go enable this one more wood. End the day. The first letter of the Latin name of a plant known as Golden Light. The number of petals on a lucky Cabalia flower. When her chance finally came, she did not hesitate even for a moment. Afterward, when Arda was dead, she felt only elation. Years after she had first laid eyes on the book, she had what she needed. Wait, yeah, okay, so Golden Light is... where is that one? Common Trail, Skinny Root, Terbor, Venet, Weeping Bell. I think it was the weeping bell, yeah. 
Oh, the night. No, it's gone. The weeping bell. The weeping bell. Yeah, golden light. So it's L. And then how many for a Cabellia flower? Lucky Cabellia. Seven petal. L7. Seven. seven L. L7. I ambled through the meadowland, stopping by every so often to examine any wildflowers that catch my eye. Buttercups, daisies, cowslips, red clover, na napweed, cat's ear, and hidden among them something new for my collection. Ding! It came for us. We were attacked by the night by the servant. In all my time in the forest, I've never experienced anything like what happened last night. The forest came alive and drove the beast back. Arduina saved us. It's the only explanation that makes any sense. Ding! One thing is clear. We cannot do this alone and we must not allow the servant to get his hands on what he's looking for. I'm trusting you with this. A secret that the sisterhood has kept for hundreds of years. A tool to defeat the Woken Dendru. Keep it safe. Use it wisely. You'll know how to open it, of course. No, I do not. What the hell? I don't have a key. What am I supposed to do with this? Okay. Ding. They're saying the sister that's been attacked. I don't know much about the seeds of redemption. Just got all excited about it. There's a bunch of them chanting outside Pulliver's right now. Foxfield Trident. All right. Let's go, Foxfield Trident. Foxfield, Foxfield. There, Foxfield. Trident. Where's this one? Oops, that's Cops Lock. Eight. M. 8 M. M. 8. Why did I come here? What? Isn't that the Foxfield Trident? Okay, wait. Foxfield Trident. Unless it means like the one beside it, the M7, whatever. Okay. Oh, sorry. Why did I go to M? That's so far. Uh, M8. Okay, this is K8. K8, K8. My bad. I had to excite it. I'm going to Blackcomb. I will kill this servant. My people are saying he who lives without fear does not live at all. I will not say that I'm af not afraid, but it would be no bad thing to die hunting such a noble adversary. I will take Ember Soul. Why not give him lesser Mary Doc? What would lesser Mary Doc do to him? Oh, the round head of the flower made of a single drop of small size sap from this plant can utterly drain a person's mental faculties. I know, I know, I know Embersol, but do I? Do I kill the man? Do I let him die? Do I give him something that will make him die? It's eye bright, spread, chicken's worth, fox button, fever, kiss, which fee, wild, cold, it is. Shimmer long, hop heart, gilded dendra, norwood, ember soul. Yeah, let's protect him. You know what? Yeah, let's do that. Widow's wool. Fox feel the trident points in the direction of some foot. Yes. Did the card burn up? Is it gone? Yeah, okay, it's gone. Allow me to present my services. I own a small shop that specializes in curiosities. I would have thought that someone in your position ought to be interested in perusing our collection of manuscripts and elixirs, for example. Oh, Arnside, 21 Orchard, Arnside Antiquities, 21 Orchard Road. 
Arnside. Arnside Arctic Waste. Arnside. Arnside. I would always like to go to like these weird antiquity shops. These, they, they're pretty cool looking. They got some weird stuff in there. The dark exterior of Arnside antiquities blends into the surroundings. A theater called Jones and an ugly looking haberdashery. To the extent that I walk past it three times before I find it. Inside, however, I am greeted by a world of intrigue and wonder. Old trinkets sit alongside faded books and manuscripts while strange utensils and machines use their unfathomable occupy rows unfathomable. They use unfathomable occupy rows of display cases. It is some time before I peel myself away, returning to the under mirror with two new recipes for extras that demand further study. Elixir of the Dam, made from a combination of Arbutum, Alcaratis, Moculus, Retinetia, and Men's Fort. It's the perfect exercise dangerous dangerous extreme guards. Bring a person back from the brink of death, but at the expense of their soul. Those who have drunk it to be vacant and lost alive, but no longer really with us. Alright, that's interesting. My desk is a mess. Let me just put those away. And more Raven Spider. Right, the end more raven spider. Let's see. Uh, hang on, let me pull this out. End more raven spider. Where's my map? Under mirror, end more. End more raven spider. I got scared by the cat. End more raven spider. Where are you? I have a raven on this one and more. Let's look for end more. <laughs> okay, there. End more. Raven. Raven up here. Spider. All right. 25 H H 25 A jackdaw croaks and hidden Somewhere nearby strange shapes of Old stones pierce the long grass some, Among them some plants grow Wild what is this Do the baubles look soft They are in fact quite hard Have you heard of the masked woman? Imagine having that amount of power. Nations would kneel before you. You would be a god. That creature, it's huge and solid and they say it obeys her every command. I would certainly come in helpful with my father-in-law tomorrow. I guess I'll have to settle for some Daisy Dock to help me get through it instead. Daisy Dock. That's the wrong one. A simple potion that will grant courage when brewed from, can be removed from these. It's said that ancient warriors would take it before going into battle. Ha. Huh. Oh god, which one's my Daisy Dock? Yeah, I have some of that around here, but there's like no description whatsoever. It's just the leaf shape. Which I guess I've gotten by on less before. Give me a moment. Uno momento. Is this it? Daisy Dock? Bluish purple flowers. Yeah, this is it. Daisy Dock. All right. Dead man's fingers. Let's label this one. Where's my Daisy Dock? I immediately lost it. Daisy Dock. Ding. Letter was delivered in an unusual way. There's no address provided. Just the horticulture is spelled wrong. I have to assume it was meant for you. If you know your plants, this letter is for you. Ho oh, ho, so you got it working. Oh, yes, yes, it works. It works, look, to the north of Bofell at the source of the river Esk. Nobody knows it grows there. It will be our little secret. Ho ho. Look to the north of Bofell at the source of the river. Okay. Look to the north of Bofell. Look to the north of the Bofell. 
Bofell. There, look to the north of Bofell at the source of the river. Sure enough, I find a plant that I've never seen before. Put you away. Archive you. Put you. Put you away. Ding. My husband likes to forge for mushrooms, but I'm worried about the ones he's brought back from his latest venture. He's just been on a trip across the lake exploring the woods to the west of here. He's got a bag full of odd looking mushrooms, but he says are perfectly safe, but they don't look edible to me. I'd have brought one with me to help identify, but he's hoarding them because he thinks I'm out going to throw them out. I'll come back tomorrow. Mushroom woods of West Undermere across the lake. Woods west of Undermere across the lake. Woods west of Undermere across the lake. I mean, they're, they're hard to find at first, but I'm seeing them everywhere now. They're just red mushrooms. Alright. Lord Freeman told me he was able to help you find some information on the servant. I've been looking all over the library, but all I've discovered is a mold problem. I hope that some sweet breath would help clear that up. Sweet breath. Uh oh. Oh, it's called Pallians. Elemental P. There you go. Pallians. Most plants improvements from air quality with Pallians are called sweet breath. Many short leaves of this plant I thought to help. Okay, so it's many short leaves. It's hop heart. It's not it. It's meat you. Also not it. Quite beautiful, really. I need to find a flower with many short leaves. Oh, this one has many short leaves. Somewhat pungent, but it should... No, this isn't it, because why would why would the pungent one be... It has a pleasant, fresh aroma. I got it. I knew it. All right. Sour bandy. Pallians. Pallians. My cousin will be married in three days. I, if you got some trimble huff, then it'd save me the trouble of going out to find some myself. You know, my cousin, you know, she's not worth the trouble. Trimble huff. Trimble up is traditionally used as a decoration for weddings that is thought to strengthen relationships. Cross section, small cup like size, generally pointed downwards so it fill with water and allow easy access for pollinating insects. Alright, so Trimble Huff. Trimble Huff. Upside down and it's. Trimble Huff. Trimble Huff? Cup like flowers. Yeah, I think this is it. Wait, let me look at this one first. Bell like flowers, heart shaped leaves. Sounds like a. No, that's not it. Okay. Small cup like upside down. Hmm. My first wrong one in a while. That's so sad. That's Jacob's worth. Do I have that? Wait, small and cup like. I do have that. All right. Small cup like flowers that are growing downward. It's a seed pod. Which one is this? Sure, it's one of these. This, that does not. Okay, whatever. These flowers are blue. Trimble huff. Blowhorn. Trimble huff. Trimble huff. I feel like I can finish the game today if I keep trying. It doesn't feel very long. Eight miles to the east. The shepherd watched as she prepared the leaves 
and roots that she would acquire. He watched the Ars Dragon sunset and worked by a candlelight. At times still, at times moving like a dancer among the stones. The change happened suddenly, but also suddenly. So at first, the watcher was not sure that anything had happened. Then he saw it. I think this is 8 miles to the east of the Great Oak. So let's see. Where's the Great Oak? 9... N. Alright. 9 N. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay, that's not correct. Hmm. Or it has something to do with the coin. Yeah, it's the Great Oak. Eight miles to the east. And that is the Great Oak, right? Yeah. One. Yeah, the Great Oak. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh. Alright. Here then, okay, fine. Okay. He, well, he went and ate those bloody mushrooms, and of course now he's sick. Is there anything we can do? He's in a bad way, and I'm worried about him. I need to make an elixir out of this. The question is, though, what is this? Red caps have a spongy texture, so I have to first look in the book. Once I figure out what they are. The Devil's Night Trap? No. Spongy... Mushroom. Farmers worry. Spongy mushroom would put only safe to consume in small quantities. Grants great strength for short periods of severe fatigue once the effect is worn off. Okay, so I, I need a cure for the spongy... for the fa farmer's worry. No. No. There we go. Farmer's worry. Antidote can be made using Royal Gentia. So let's go here. And where's my Royal Gentia? Royal Gentia. Two large kidney shaped petals. It's over here. If I remember right. Worry less. Royal Gentia. There we go. Farmers often fatal the antidote they may be using royal gentia. Wait. Then how do I brew it? Do I just keep putting royal gentia? No, wait. Oh, I'm so stupid. I just realized I could open the other one. Hang on. Where's my lock hearts? I just realized that I have a flower that can open locks. Damn it. But I can't remember the name. I know it's known as the lock heart, but I can't remember what... Which one it was. Harlequin Blue. No, Jigsworth. No. Pain Relief. Lady of Summer. Merry Doc. The Lock Heart. Hmm. Can you? I forgot that you have a flower that can literally unlock any lock. A sour bread. Tree of 
Kimball Huff wanted the weekend bell, no. Would Bob Cole, which fits a bit more, were you less lucky? No. I have to start all the way from the beginning. I need to figure out which one it does. Arguria? Bishop Parasol, Butterdale, Brimlock. No, that's not it. Cabaldia, Candlewood. Clavil there, Clavillium. Clavillium. Which one's my Clavillium? I should really start putting this in alphabetical order. Clavillium, Clavillium, Common Charles, Eyebright, Pallions, Mary's Breath, Jacob's Worth, Fox Button, Pink, No. Heart shaped petals. Heart shaped petals? More wood. Cabalia, no. Caldery is what I'm looking for. Oh, sorry, Clavillium is what I'm looking for. Fine, just look for like the one with heart shaped thieves. Clavillium. Hard and dry. Now, Liquor Boar. Clavillium. Mary's Breath. Is this the Clavillium? I open. I'm so smart. First is the Corpse Friend, a reminder. Then comes the Ankle Grabber, the Binder. Third is the Fear Bringer, fourth to lift the curse, last the Petal to secure Black Blood Servers. Okay, I can't make it yet because I need five, but yeah. How do I brew? Pathogen's Guide to Fatal Fungi and Their Antidotes. Pop Heart Boiled in Sugar. Sour bag. Cure often fatal an antidote to be made using royal gentia. Okay, but how do I make an antidote? No. 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 Saint Quentin's. So you need royal gentia, yeah, but like how will you make the antidotes? Give me a second. Oh, or did I just give her the royal gentia? I just give her the royal I thought okay. I thought I had to make it myself. My bad. I've been to Black Comb. I fought the servant and lived, but still have my ad but still my adversary. It must be defeated. For my part, I am ashamed to say that I am done. And my soul could use the tonic of Saint Quentin's elixir if I am ever to recover from the horror that I've seen. Alright, buddy. A five-pointed leaf. Yeah, alright, let's see. Five-pointed leaf to grant courage. Do I have any five-pointed leaves? Five pointed leaf. One, two, that's more than five. Five pointed leaf? What leaves have five? This is, this is not five pointed. Purple flowers with a gentle scent. Oh. Oh, St. John's Poppy. One, two, three, four, five. Five pointed leaf to grant courage. A red flower. A red flower to protect the mind. I write. And a seed pod for luck. Is this a seed pod? Great evidence. Oh no, that messed up. A seed pod. Seed pod. Alright, give me a moment. I'm going to read through seed pods. Hmm? Let's see. Seed pod. Is some properties? No. Seed pod. Hmm. 
Yes, this one is this one is a seed pod. Where is that? Spiky over here is a seed pod. Maybe it's the eye bright that's the problem. I know I need a cabalia. Rare plant believed to help. Let's see. Are you the Kabalia? It's the Royal Gentia. Gentel. Eyebright. Because the Kabalia brings luck. I need a red flower. Let's meet you. Five pointed leaf to grant courage. I got that. The red flower to protect the mind. Oh no, it's a red flower to protect the mind. Red flower that protects the mind. Royal Gentia protect the mind. Hang on. Royal Gentia. To release. No, it does not. Ember Soul. Okay. I break. What's this do? No, it only improves eyesight. I need something that protects the mind. And I know I read one of them has that. It all has to be a red flower. So it's a red flower that protects the mind. It's not the Royal Gentia. Is it the Weeping Bell? Or am I overthinking this? can be bound to see no that's not it no that that gives you painful sores I'm absolutely sure about like the five point one what I'm lacking is like I think the red flower and the seed, well, the seed pod is also not very sure. What the heck? Okay. Why must you be so cryptic? Seed pod for luck. Toxins. Okay, wait. What the heck? Why those three? A daisy dock, the, the candlewood, and the sheep snap? Oh, come on. Candlewood. Red flower produces shielding. Long thin stems grow among tall leaves. Mm. 
Yep, sit. I got Candlewood, right? Daisy Dock, Candlewood, and Sheep Snap. Yeah, okay, so I've seen the Daisy Dock before. That's St. John's Poppy. Daisy Dock, Daisy Dock. This better not be the Daisy Dock. Where are you, Daisy Dock? Ah. Daisy Dock. Did I lose the Daisy Dock? There we go, Daisy Dock. I guess that's also 5 point. And uh, snap. Sheep snap. Oh, no. Okay, what about the sheep snap? Sheep snap. Green seed pods. There we go. Yeah, so I was right. This is it. Well, I was... I got... I got the one I was most sure of wrong. Okay, this is St. Quentin's Elixir. St. Quentin's Elixir. I... I messed that up. Oh god. Okay, you can't see anything good. St. Quentin's Elixir. All right, collect. Hurdle. There's a hateful man I sometimes hear around town. He's called Isidore Burbage. Yeah, this is why I'm bending down so the pet straight up and said he punched it as. Wow! What an asshole. Hard as he could. I rushed over and the coward fled. Someday he'll get his come up once. Yeah, I'm gonna poison him. He gets poisoned next, that's for sure. Sad Guild Chalice. Alright, let's go for the Sad Guild Chalice. Where are you, Sad Gil? Alright. Uh, sad Gil, Sad Gil. Sad Gil. Oh, there you go. Sad Gil Chalice. Okay. On the river sprint. Chalice clue takes me directly south of Sad Gill. Collect the plant. Oh, that's a Venus flytrap. Wait, did I complete the other card though or not yet? <sighs> yeah, I haven't done this. Eight miles to the east. Eight miles to the east of the Great Oak. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, all right. Let's try that one. After I bring up another person, Reuben Ward. Verona tells me you're working on gathering plants for it to help us defeat this creature. I want to help any way I can. From what Verona told me, one of the plants needs to show, but I'm afraid I don't know what can be found. Swift snare. Yeah, I need some swift snare. The day is Cornwall. Read, read somewhere about the plant, I'll lead you to gold. <laughs> Red flan. Yeah, I, I got that one to worry about it. Where are you? Jacob's Worth. No, Mary's Breath. Where are you? Not Eyebright. Not Larchine. Weeping Bell. Yeah. I, I'm very sure I already have some of my, pla some of my plants. And it's ill for it. I cannot believe that Dre Huntman is still alive. You don't seem to understand the importance of our work here. If you're not with us, then you are against us. Whether it comes and will come, you'll regret your actions. Praise the Dendru. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
So I wasn't supposed to do that. I was supposed to like keep him on my side as long as possible. But then now that the cat's out of the bag, I am going to kill him. Ah, oh, come on. How's that not it? Isn't this the Great Oak? Okay. Put you back here. Eight miles to the east of the Great Oak. Yeah. Unless I'm forgetting something about the Great Oak. No, get out of the way. Ah. Eight miles to the east. Like if it low it, it low it itself. Hmm. I died? That killed me? Oh, come on. Now I have to fix my brain again. That's so dumb. I messed that up. Oh, that's so bad. feel revived, my mind is whole again, but I have to repeat that entire day because I messed up that badly. God. Damn it. Okay. Oh no, I didn't. Okay, that's good. Uh. Alright, I'll be right back. I just need to get something to drink. My throat's a bit dry. Thank you. 
I'm back. Uh, yeah, I had to go to the bathroom also. Uh, what the hell? <laughs> Sorry. Wait. Oh, there's Goss for it. Uh, okay, wait. So it's even lost to the east of Gosford. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What? It's still wrong? What the fuck? Where am I supposed to go? Wait, I'm not gonna go to sleep until I complete that challenge. Except, I, I don't think I can do it tomorrow. I love my water plants. Okay, so there's a place called Gosforth. I think that's what I'm supposed to do. Mm -hmm. I thought it was the Great Oak, but maybe not? I just gotta wait a little bit longer. Okay. Goss forth. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh my god. Gazing at the still water of the lake, its black waters draw me into the effective trance. Here and there, flowers that I don't recognize grow along the bank. God damn it. Okay, that took me way longer than it should have. Kay gives way to new growth from death life. The cycle starts again west of White Scar by the river. Behind the woman, a dark subtle figure begins to rise. A low primal snarl sounded across the clearing. The shepherd turned and ran, cold fear coursing through his veins. He did not run for long. Okay, this is the daily hint. The Kay gives way to growth from death life. The cycle starts again. West of White Scar by the river. West of White Scar by the river. The sun beach skull fi fixes me with its black eyed gaze. A reminder from the chest skeleton a plant grows. New plant acquired! Okay, so. Wait, uh, strange horticulture. Get over here. I've lived in Undermere all my life and I've never seen the people as worried as they are now. Everyone's talking about the sisterhood and the servant. Somebody needs to do something and stop that beast. I was speaking to a woman from Arnside, told me of a cave nearby and a local stay away from. Apparently there's a strange plant that grows there but the cave is believed to be haunted. Unfortunately she was vague about the cave, somewhere to the east and was all she would say when I pressed her. Warmest regards Amos Duncan. A cave near Undermere? Somewhere to the east. Bridal cave? A dark pool sits in the belly. I suppress a shudder. I thought of monsters that could lurk beneath its serene surface. Okay, that's not it. Hmm. What's the letter? Follow Dudan tributary to its... Oh. Follow the Dudan tributary to its source. I, I, keep for I forgot. I should probably do that. Wait, let's, where's the Dudden tributary? Dudden tributary to its source. Farfield Peak, Grassmere King, Sadgill River, Sprint, Dudden tributary, River, River Levin, tributary, Lake Undermere. Dun 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 dun. River Dudden, there. River Dudden to its source. Okay. It's over there. Hang on. Why can't I remember? There was something important, but now there's only darkness. A sour bandy. Sour bandy. Whoops. That's not it. That's not it. Sour bandy. Memory of delivery sour. Oh! 
memory is deliberately sabotaged. The name is bad. Okay, it both large same is extremely bitter to the taste. Okay. Which of my plants has a large stamen? No, it's Mary's breath. Sour bandy. I feel like I have seen it before. Is this it? Large stamen. There we go. That's the sour bandy. A woman in jade mask was screaming at me to get out. Instead, I went deeper and entered the mind of the creature. It's like slipping in a dark pool. The icy cold with who, kn with who knows what there is lurking beneath the surface. I felt powerful. And suddenly something happened. She tore me out and my mind went dark. Okay. I have not been myself lately. Alright. So this is getting a bit more interesting. Told me of a cave nearby that the locals stay away from. Apparently, it's a strange plant that goes there. Apparently, she was vague about where the cave was, somewhere to the east. All she was really impressed there. It's not the royal cave. R Rydal cave, sorry. Because I looked through that. It's just somewhere to the east of Undermere. Huh. Mushrooms, I've already got enough though. Okay. I only have somewhere to the east. I am s ah no, sorry. I kept going to the west. Okay, okay. Uh. My wife of thirty years is dying. That is the truth of of it. As painful as I could say it out loud, doctor, see, there's nothing they can do. But I cannot sit by and wait for it to happen. A man at the hospital said to him about the plant-based extra. I don't think he meant for me to hear about, but I did, and I, that's all I can think about. I understand the risks, but any price is worth paying if it means she doesn't have to die. Please, I'm begging you. All right, man. If you if you insist. Where's that? Elixir of the Damned. Herbutum Alacritus. Let's go back to the start. Okay, wait, no. Arbutum Alacritus Cabalia Cabalia What's that noise? Oh god My alarm went off Arbutum Alacritus So that's the Cabalia Nope, that's, that's five petaled Arbutum alacritus. It's a six petal flower. There we go. Cabalia. Mens. Maculosus retentia. Maculosus retentia. White scar cave. Uh, farmer's worry. Okay, collect the plants. But I need to label farmer's worry, hang on. I just realized I didn't label the farmer's worry. Farmer's worry. Farmer's worry. What about... Yeah, okay, so I need to put the Cabalia in first. Cabalia. Oops, I lost it. Cabalia. Cabalia. That's not the Cabalia. That's just. I should organize my shelves better. Where's my six petal flower? No. St. John's Poppy. No, this is dark. Oh, this one. Oh, it's Fennet. Sorry. Fennet. There, Cabalia. Cabalia. Maculosus retentia. Retinesia. Oh, there. This means Fortis. Dranthium. Yeah, I found the Dranthium earlier. 
long sharp leaves is this the track theme? no that's not it long sharp leaves is it? no Yeah, this is a Dranthium, I think. Let me label it first. Dranthium. And last but not the least, the Maculosus retinesia, which is. Oh, there. Henchuk. Small startling effects. Even a small dose can result in short term memory. So it's a large bulbed plant. No. A tuberous bulb has initial structure grows and bursts, gives it stripe. Okay, so it's striped. It's a striped bulb. Is it? When cut open, the outer blue bean is ready to harvest. Is this it? It's a striped bulb. Is that my only striped bulb though? It seems to be. It is not. Okay. This is the only one I'm not sure of. Henchuk. Henchuk. Which one is the Henchuk? Just look around. Hmm. Henchuk. No, it's the forest camphrey. That's mountain ast astery? Hang on. <laughs> Sorry. Chuck. This one have striped bulbs? Wait. I don't know. Is this a striped bulb? Blue green. Is that turquoise? Firm and turquoise in color. Is that correct? Okay, that worked. God, okay. Which one was that again? Where's my hand chuck? Uh, I lost it again. Whoops. I lost the hand chuck. It had orange fruit, right? Oh well. I need to, um. Where is that? Where are my labels? Elixir of the Damned. Elixir of the Damned. And then this one is also gone. Henchuk, that's Henchuk, okay. Henchuk. Okay, Elixir of the Damned for you. Oh, that's so sad though. His wife is gonna be dead. Like, the living dead. What a delightful shop you have. I'm only down for a brief visit, but I heard I might have some of Liverstone here. Liverstone. Chai Chi KL. Liverstone. Oh, paralyzing. Liverstone's mushroom with pointed caps. Okay, I have a lot of those. Is this it? Seems to give off a small amount of light. It smells rotten. Is this it? No, that's not it. Okay. 
Okay, where are my mushrooms? Is it, this one has a pointed cap. Oh, yeah. Okay, there we go. That's the liver stone. Okay. Liver stone. I should label these better. Oh, it's a jade mask woman. I can't control it anymore. This has all gone too far. I never meant for it to turn on my sisters. It's too strong. I'm trying to hold it back, but it wants to kill. That's all it wants. Death, death, and more death. You have to help me. What does Widow's Woe do? Dead man's fingers. Fungus typically found in its forest. Glance. Set the strength and resolve and sharpen the mind. What's Widow's Woe do? Induced fear. Nah, I'll give her the I'll give her the dead man's fingers. Fungus is typically at a glance it can appear as though it's a corpse. Set to strength and resolve. The fungus the fungus is typically found in dense forest protruding at mulch at a glance because a corpse is reaching up from underground. Okay, fungus. Digits mort yeah, here we go. Digitatus mortis. The dead man's fingers. Hollis Gibb. We've been talking the last few nights on the Oral Oak of the observant creature going around slaughtering people. I used to enjoy walking the hills, but I daren't leave my house now. I've decided to bring nature to me in the meantime. The glow of a few pixie lamps will surely warm my heart. Pixie lamps. Pixie lamps. Oh no. Wait, that's the. Uh, where is that? Which of my flowers glows? There. What's your name? Norwood. KLM. Where's the Norwood? Norwood. No, it's not it. Pixie lamps. Sweet bread. Brittle crushed or ebony blood spilled. No, pixie lamps. Pixie lamps. A hell's gate. Solomon scorn. Sour bandy. Saint John's poppy. Spring wax cap. Sunset mount trap. Stinking mount cap. No mount cap. Uh, it's handy to death. Pronounced the tomb. Swift snare. Twilight lip. In the pure tunnels. Okay, in the twilight shadows grow thick. Okay, no. Wandering view. Fingers bane. Wild cold hair of a dog. Camp foot and pussy. Witch fig. Blue. Pixie lamps. Oh, it's called glow horn. I wasn't looking. Sorry. I was paying attention. Glow horn. There we go. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Penny Bell. Glowhorn. End the day. Oh, I was supposed to explore the river. I keep forgetting. To the east of the castle, across the river, and through the mountain pass, it grows to the edge of the wood. To the east of the castle, across the river, and through the mountain path, it goes to the edge of the wood. She finally had the power to create all these years, a servant to do as she will, but that power came at a cost. The servant was awoken and would not be contained. It was the Dendru, the dread, it was death. Day 16, Saturday. East of the castle, across the river. East of the castle. Across the river. How many castles do we have? Wait. East of the castle, across the river, through the mountain path. Hang on. Uh, I was supposed to look at this, at this one. Hard not. Why did I come here? Okay, no. Where is that thing that I saw? There, there, there. Follow the Duden tributary to its source. Yeah, River Dudon.
Oh, okay. Hold on. Um, let me just check some other stuff. East of the castle, across the river, and through the mountain pass, it grows to the edge of the wood. To the east of the castle, across the river. To the east of the castle. Do we have any other castles here? Across the river. To the east of the castle. Egremont Castle seems to be the only one, though. So, I think that's it. East of the castle, across the river, and through the mountain path. Hmm. East of the castle, across the river, through the mountain pass at the edge of the wood. Is it like Torver or Jack's Rake? East of the mountain. East of the what? East of the castle? Oops. Ah. East of the castle, across the mountain path. East of the castle, across the mountain path. East of the castle. Across the mountain path. Oh, there's another one. East of the castle, across the mountain path, at the edge of the wood. There, okay. Okay, here we go. We're supposed to do it. This one. East the mountain, across the mountain. East of the castle, across the mountain path. There we go. Our new find. We plant acquired. And then I have to follow the Dudon tributary to its source. River Dudon is over here. I think that's the source. I, I guess I just have to wait for it to, you know, load. How about I water the plants? Where's my watering can? It's all the way over here. Oh, there it is, watering can. not giving me anything. Is it okay? Okay, so let's go to the... This one. Or is it this one? Oh, there we go. That's the tributary. Okay, there we go. Alright. So, ding. It's time. The servant is on the move again. Time to act. Meet me at the ritual site. I hope for all our sakes to be able to track down all the plants we need. Okay. Plants are not known. Oh, here it is. First is the corpse's friend, a reminder that comes. Okay. Okay, first is the corpse's friend. What's the corpse's friend? <laughs> Sorry. First is the corpse's friend. Corpse's friend. Corpse's friend. Patches, advanced fingers, Stacy Dog. Corpse's friend, there. The devil's night trap. How can I tell which one? It's a light, pleasant smell, not the sort of pine needles boiling in the wood. Oh god, I saw this already before. The plant was called colloquially as the corpse's friend. Night pleasant scent, not the same. Which one's the corpse's friend, though? Okay, hold on. Uh, my, speak, my nose is itching. Which one is it? Which one is the flower? Okay, there we go. 
That's the devil's friend. Wait, let me let me label them. Corpse's friend. What's the second one? No, get out of the way. Get out of the way. Close. Okay. Ankle grabber. Yeah, I know the ankle grabber. The ankle grabber is the uh, what's that called? The 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 snap, the snare. Starts with an S. The uh, no, not mount trap. Swift snare. There we go. Swift snare has small heart shaped leaves. Swift snare, heart shaped leaves. Is this it? Smooth waxy leaves. No. They smell pleasant. No. Small heart shaped leaves. Which one are you? Oh, is this it? Wait, let me look at it. Yeah, okay, there we go. Swift snare. Swift snare. Swift snare. The binder. Third is the fear bringer. Which one is that? The fear bringer. The fear bringer. Hang on. The fear bringer. Induce fear there. Widow's woe. The camp foot. Dainty dark flowers grow out from a bed of long, thin leaves. Is this it? Dark red flowers. I think this is the widow's woe? Yeah, it has, an, it has an unpleasant scent and it has... Yeah, okay. This is widow's woe. This is it. Widow's woe. Um, what's the fifth, fourth one? Fourth, the lift the curse. Yeah, wait, I did that earlier. That was the witch's something, I think. The witch fig. Infection. Fever kiss plant. No. No, that's not it. No. Uh, Agoria? No, it might be something that I haven't unlocked yet. Hang on. Carnivorous forest. Caldery. No, that's successful hunt. How about Devil's Night Trap? Evolum. No. I right, Fever Kiss. Forest Camfrey. Fox Button. Killed it then. Draw candy. Gandhi Root. Kill the dendra. Irish apart. No. Jacob's worth. No, that's for like finding people. A lady of summer. Dark shine. Lum and dandy. What have I not like looked at yet? L. Lesser Mary Doc. Hello, Mary Doc. More yellow. Single drop. Small things. No. No. Lila. No. No. Oh, lift curses there. The witch's remedy. Long vericund. Okay, 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 okay. Um, where are you? Where's the long vericund? Long vericund. Long vericund. If I forgot to label the long ver vericund, I'd be so upset. Because I know I've seen this one before. Did I forget to label it? Oh my god. Fennet, weeping bell. Long vericund. There we go. Long very kind. I should probably put them together though. Long very kind. I'll get out of here. Shimmer. Pop heart. Dendra. Let's go. Uh, Widow's Woe. And then the other one was the Carps' Friend. What's the fourth one? No, wait. That's the third one. What's the. F third is the Fear Bringer. Oh god, I forgot which one the fear bringer was. Fear bringer was uh, no, not widow's woe, Carp's friend, long fairy con. What's the fear bringer? Jacob's worth, Saint John's poppy, no, fox button, grantium, cavalier, daisy dock, gandy root. I'll remember it when I see it. Uh, fennet, weeping bell, no, wandering boo. Gilded dendra, no, I don't think it's the gilded dendra. 
it's um what about uh, what do I need uh so it's the fear bringer I forgot which one was my fear bringer again hmm it was something that I have not looked at. If I remember that. Because like, I remember that that's why I thought everything I didn't look at was what did it. Spring wax cap, winter boar, worry less. Is it the twilight? Well, the piota, the Trimblehof, the liver stone, the penny ball. What about... Very conned. This carpet's friend, widow's woe, long, very conned. Oh, wait, no, wait. Is it the widow's woe? Yeah, that, that that's it. That's the one that induces fear. Then what am I missing? Oh, wait, the swift snare. I forgot the swift snare. There we go. Swift snare, and now I need um, last one. Last petal to secure black blood's reverse. I remember this one. Um, it's the E. It starts with an E. Uh, Elder Finium. There we go. The Elder Finium. Right. Then there's Miasma. Is it black and dwelling and painful death? Tells me a brute yet. Antelope. Then there's Miasma. This, this one's it, right? Yeah, this one's it. With an odd protrusion. No wait, that's not it. Sorry, Th that's different. That's the that's the apoxy thing. That's that that's not it. That 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 would have gotten me killed. Hang on, I I I labeled the elder finium right? Or was that the one that I lost that I forgot to label? Elder finium. I it I remember it's a fancy looking flower compared at least to the others. Did I label the Elder Finium? I can't even remember. Oh god, I hope I found I, I hope I can find it. I, I I know that I did the quests to get it. I just don't know which one it is. Or did I lose it somehow? Elder Finium. Elder Finium. Elder Finium. That's not the Elder Finium. Where did I put it? That's not the Elder Finium, right? Okay. No, see, it has a check, so that means that I did have it. It has a strong, sweet aroma. Hmm, intoxicating scent. Daisy Dock. Moving well, Fanet. Elder Finium, there we go. Ah, I did label it. That's good. Okay, I think we're good. Okay. Where's the site? Where's the site? I can't remember where the site is. Oh wait, that's right. Uh, it's written somewhere here. Hang on. South of the Watcher, the Great Oak in the Dendrous. My nearest is the site of ritual import was created near Black Home to the south of the Watcher, the Great Oak. Right, so it's at the Great Oak. Ah, uh, genius. Okay, so it's at nine and nine. The UG stands before me. Uh, for branches, gaze the sky. That's not it. I thought it was the Great Oak. Near Black Home to the south of the Watcher, the Great Oak in the Dendry was up. South of the Watcher? What? Black Home, south of the Watcher, the Great Oak. And the Dendry was ousted from this world. Where is that then? If not... If not that... 
That is the Great Oak, right? The Tomb of the Hunter. Did I forget something? Elder Finium goes here. The Tomb of the Hunter. No, I've been there. I am in a rush. What do you mean you have neither the time nor the inclination? You are literally the only person who could solve this one. And the world will probably end if you don't do anything about it. Okay. The black comb? Wait, what did it say? Created near the black comb to the south of the Watcher. Great oak and a dentry was asked to drink this world. To the south of the watcher. What do you mean nothing here? Wait, where am I supposed to go then? Uh no, that's not the watering can. A small stone shrine sits off to one side clearing. Five grooves run out from the center of the stone, widening the recesses. Five slots for five plants. Okay, I put them all up here. Right? Okay, Elder Finium. No, okay, I need to... Do I, do, do I need to do it in order? Um, do I need to do it in order? First is the corpse's friend. Second is the ankle grabber. Third is the fear bringer. Fourth to lift the curse. And fifth. Okay. Well done. I'll take it from here. Continue. I stand back and watch as Verona walks around the shrine, muttering soft incantations. It feels like a long time passes before she looks up, but in reality, it's perhaps only 10 minutes. Nothing's happening. What do you mean nothing's happening? Have we got the right plans? I think so. Perhaps we just need to be patient. A loud noise panels makes us all jump. Turning around, I see something that makes my blood run cold. The woman in the jade mask is walking calmly and slowly towards us from the other side of the theory. Behind her standing tall and terrifying is the black silhouette of the servant. Oh wow, he's ugly. What was that about being patient? I think we're out of time. Do not be afraid. I'm here to surrender willingly. The servant cannot be allowed to ARG! The creature lunges forward and brings a huge arm scything towards her. Her scream pierces the cold air as she drops to her knees, clutching her head, but the blow seems to glance off to one side as it comes hurtling down, and the beast claw ends up embedded in the dirt instead of the woman's back. I can't hold it back much longer. You need this! She throws a small vial of red liquid, which Ruben deftly catches and holds up to the light. Blood. Quickly, I know what to do! Verona grabs the vial and fumbles to get the stopper out as she turns it back to the shrine. The servant has its huge arm free again, slowly advancing in strange jerking movements. Verona pours the blood to the small cavity in the shrine. Everything seems to happen at once. A pillar of bright light, light launches out of the shrine towards the servant and hits it in its chest. The huge beast shrieks and staggers backwards, drowning the screams of the woman in the jade mask who is clutching her head and writhing in agony on the ground. Oh, that's bright. There's an almighty thunderclap and a blinding flash of light and suddenly the servant is gone. A patch of charred ground smolders where it stood moments before. My head is spinning at what has happened. Did it work? Have we defeated the servant? Did we do it? Friday. Oh, I got the banished ending. With the dust settled and the servant vanquished, I've been able to reflect on events for the last few weeks. Where we, we were fortunate that Thea was able to stay in control of the beast for as long as she did. Who can say what would have happened if she was unable to prevent it causing the destruction it craved? Undermere was just left. Well, never felt so jubilant, so full of life. 
all the nervous tension that had built up evaporated in an instant and the people have plowed their energies into celebration and merriment. They do not know the whole truth of the course that Thea, the woman in Jade Mask, was the one who summoned the servant. I promised Ruben that I would leave it to him to unravel that mess. She is his daughter after all. And as for myself, well, I'm back in the column of the strange horticulture, of course, with Hellbore for company. He's quieter around here, but I'm content with... It's quieter around here, but I'm content with... And there are always more plants to learn about and discover. Sleeping Tenju. It is done to serve it to go back to being the text. Sorry for this. I got the second ending, so that means there's several endings. Alive, alive, in hiding, wounded, both body and pride of being. In hiding, the award woman in the jade mask. Alive is the Burr Bridge. Currently pursuing legal action against strange horticul. I hate this guy. I hate the. I I should have killed this in our Burr Bridge when I had the chance. Okay, so that that is the ending. I got one of the endings. Huh. And it only took me four and a half hours. I'd say I made pretty good time on that. Besides all the fumbling and dying by accident. Well, it's about lunchtime for me, so I really should get going. Thanks for stopping by in the stream today uh, and watching me fumble around with plants and make mistakes and poison my customers. Though I really should have poisoned the customers that deserve to be poisoned. Because really, one of the guys punched the dog. He deserves it. Um, I'll, uh, I'll, I'm thinking of streaming again maybe Monday or possibly tomorrow, but then most likely Monday. We'll see what I can pull up. I've always wanted to play EDF. I don't think I'll be playing like the other endings on stream, but then I do encourage you guys to play this one and try to get the other endings because definitely some of those villagers deserve to eat the wrong plants. Anyway, thanks for coming around. Thanks for stopping by everyone and um, have a wonderful day or night or afternoon wherever you are. Bye!